Okay, I'm in the lobby of the Merlot. All right, let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Can you hear yourself? <laughs> what was that? Hello. I think someone else is hacking in. Yeah. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Oh, shit. You're scanning the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Help me. Damien, it's over. I'm disconnected. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Got a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. Gave the order. <laughs> don't. I don't know. You don't know. Ain't the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. So what do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name. Yeah, I'll tell you a name. Boom. Kids, all right? That wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys. I heard stories, man, that like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Sometimes you can't walk away please! from. Please, please. Who gave the order? I spoke to them on the phone and they told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know. A name. Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me. Ah! How's your memory now? Ah. Are 
Chris won't talk to me, but I bet he talked to you. Shaking, motherfucker. Shit. Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. Like you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> huh. Nice shot. Huh. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah, true story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. You'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. Man, handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. Tip said we're looking for gangbangers. Sweep the room. Careful, these shit bags don't play. Wish they'd just play in their own backyard. Wish they'd just play in their own backyard. Gunshot wounds. I got another corpse. Another viceroy. <laughs> Victimless crime, then. <laughs> Squad, we've got two bodies. <laughs> Copy, we're sending forensics. Secure your position for now. We're sweeping each level of the stadium. Roger the polls now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base steals on this team with 27 steals this series, but Sanova's watching them like a hawk. That's a pitch and a hit, and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Roger's not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. See anything? Two on, two nope. out, folks. Right Something's gonna get soon, and it could go either way. He's got a known dice roll. Sonoma yeah, pitches. That's a big hit. Okay, I'm coming up. He's not moving unless I give him a reason. Just talking. Look, I got my tickets right no, here. No, yeah. keep your hands where I can hey, see them. this is bullshit. Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're vice wars, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. How did you two afford VIP tickets? Mm, bet she makes more than you do. Yeah? 
Hey, yo, what? Didi, calm down, all right? Don't give them nothing they can use. Something tells me if we run you shit stains through the system, we'll come up with plenty we can use. I need to see ID. Both of you. Well, I ain't showing shit. Hey, hey y'all filming this? I want to see this motherfucker online. Fine. I don't need ID. I'd ask you to smile, but it works better if you don't. Hey, man. I did not give you permission to take my picture. Here we go. Jerome Richards. Looks like we got a trafficking warrant out on you. That we can definitely use. Man, this is messed up. We got right? Just keep quiet a minute. You have that right. Fuck you. are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. Do it all stay here? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with a serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. With all these cops, there's gotta be one around. Plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. But you got an isolated incident in the basement, we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. That's gonna cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. Oh, shut it down? I, I can't make that call. Well, then call somebody who can make that call, please. Okay, hang on. Where are you, Jordy? What? Gone. I'm allergic to cops. So is Maurice. But don't worry, I left you a present. Friend of a friend deals in pre-owned cars. Got a real beauty waiting for you in the garage across the street. Yes. You leave it. I just I saw a bunch of cops care. fly by out there. Gotta go. That's a lot of sirens for a blackout. Shit, something ain't right. We should stay put. All units, suspect is still in the facility. Let's find them.
happy. These guys, I heard stories, man, that like nothing I've ever seen before. You better walk away from this, man. Why are you sitting here? He's coming, right? Not like last time. Jackson, I did invite him. It's been so long. Are you sure you called the right number? Honey, your uncle's a different kind of person. It doesn't mean he doesn't love us. So in finding Maurice was correct. We've gained access to the CTUS back door while the police were being distracted by you. Since we both win in this, we'll share what we have. That back door allows you some access to the CTUS network. I'm still working on something bigger. Give me time. <laughs> Never a dream of her tiny face pressing the window when she knows I was coming over. Or that little wobbly dance she did. It's always the same nightmare. I need to get my mind off things. Lucky for me, this city's full of distractions. And they can't hide from me. I'll have to thank CTOS one day. Simple breach of their facial recognition software, and I've got access to everyone's personal details. out of control. 
I'm not gonna let him hurt anyone today. Simple trace of his call, and he's lying. All right, he's here somewhere. Just move carefully, don't get spotted. Let the profiler do the work. This should be it. She must be the woman he's after. <laughs> this guy's close. I can feel it. Hey! We need to talk. There's nothing to talk about. We're done. Deal with You're it. You're so fucking wrong. I'm not done yet. Get I gotta away. stop him now. I'll scream! Oh, I'll teach you. I'm not someone to mess with. You won't bother anyone now. What the? You not? I know, I know. The party started. It's almost over. Where are you? I'm on my way. Ugh, you make me crazy. Jackson's really looking forward to it. Get over here. We miss you. I miss you too. I'll be there. Sorry, Nick. I need to take this. I'll, I'll see you soon. Good. You got out. Look, if you need some wheels, give me a call. I'll, I'll set you up. Pre-owned cars? You'd rather register yourself at a car dealer? I don't ask questions. This guy gets me any ride I want, and you if you need it. I just might. How's Maurice doing? Oh, he's all sunshine and buttercups. I'm gonna dump him at my little dumping place. I need him alive, Jordy. Yeah, yeah, alive. Whatever. It goes against your better nature. I'd pop him and be done, but hey, you pay me right, I'll keep him alive as long as you want. I do work for a paycheck. Several members of the Chicago South Club were arrested following the police raid of a popular sports bar in Brandon Docks. No names have been released. I haven't been in Nikki since the funeral. Am I ready? Jack's last birthday, Lena sang off key. Happy birthday. Full throttle, no holes barred. Now, I'm afraid of the silence. Somebody tried to break into my house last night. Somebody tried to break into my house last night. A good way to get yourself Excuse you. <laughs> In that case, uh, you deserve ten birthday tickles. What? One, two, three, four, Whoa. five, six, Stop. seven, Whoa. eight, nine, ten. <laughs> ten. 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 Stay here for a second. So, an entire year and... Uh... You're late. Yeah, I'm sorry, Nick. Really. Let's have a look at you. You look older. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> this is his first birthday without Lena. Oh, how's he doing? 
still doesn't talk to anybody but me. Yolanda says it's his way of maintaining some sort of control. Yolanda? His therapist. She's helping him. It's good. Just slow. It's hard, but we're gonna get through it. Jax. Hey. S sorry I'm late. Can I, uh, can we get a hug? Wow. You are big. <laughs> so, hey, what, what do you got there? Wow, the healer. Cool. You bought him a real toy, huh? <laughs> Why don't you bring up your toys? I'm gonna speak with your uncle. Yeah, I'll be I'll be up there in a sec. This matters. You being here. I just need to make sure that things are different. Things are different. You and Jax are the most important people in my life. I'm not gonna stop watching out for you. <laughs> Always the big brother, huh? <laughs> Last time I was back here, it was Lena's birthday. Jackson adored her. We all did. You missed all the fun. The kids were playing vigilante, imitating that guy they keep talking about on TV. Let me guess. Jax was the vigilante. <laughs> no, they were all the vigilantes, and I was the only villain, but I make a mean bad guy. <laughs> I gave him hell. I should have come earlier. I could have warned them. Don't mess with my sister. Remember when you and Mom were both sick as dogs, but Dad insisted his boy was gonna have his birthday cake? That thing was an abomination, all burnt and lopsided. That was Dad in a nutshell. He did a lot of ugly things, but it was always about family. Listen to me, I'm rambling. Oh, really? No, 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 don't let me interrupt you. Who is this? <laughs> you think blogging caller ID will hide you? <laughs> I don't know what's so entertaining, but the police won't find it very funny at all. Listen, the police can trace this call. on those doors who is this why are you calling do you feel safe nikki who was that doesn't matter just some stupid crank it happens do you think this is strong enough look did you know his voice oh, jesus aiden just leave it it's fine it's fine he thinks he can get inside how do you know what he thinks you're checking the locks look, i can handle this on my own we do not need your help Nikki, I can find this guy. Hey, look, Aiden. God, you have not changed at all. We do not need your help. Please stop trying to fix our problems. Every time you try, you just make things worse. I better go. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Grown man making crank calls. Let's see how safe you feel when I trace your call. There you are. Damn it. He's on the move.
Yeah. I'm sorry. I overreacted. You just make me so crazy sometimes. Uh-huh. Come on back, okay? I promise I won't freak out on you. Uh... Aiden? You're going after that creep, aren't you? Well... You're doing it right now. I can't believe you. It's not like that. Stop being a hero, Aiden. Let it go. Let what? Yeah, the call's breaking up. I can't hear you. No, you can hear me perfectly. You need to stop right now. Yeah, hello? You still there? Can't hear you. Okay, gotta go. Yeah, I'm still trying. They're kicking you out. Give me time. Okay, well, I need your help then. Can you trace a phone call? How can I refuse my best client? Wait, what am I looking at here? It's from a guy who threatened my family. I want to know who hired him. Well, the call came from somewhere in the Loop District. But that's as far as I can see. Okay. I can hack CTOS inside the loop. Then I should be able to pinpoint the source of that call. Let's do that. Loom's building a new CTOS center in the loop. It's perfect. DeadSec tried to attack that center last month. We failed, and they just added more armed guards. So it won't be easy. Be careful. You sound like my sister. Relax. Make sure I'm armed and dangerous. their guards. I better double my weapons. Hey, how's it going? few weeks, CTOS centers throughout Chicago have increased security due to several attacks from activist hacker group DedSec. When asked about security changes, Bloom spokeswoman Charlotte Gardner was decisive. Chicago's safety is paramount, so we've hired private security for every CTOS control center. These highly skilled peacekeepers have trained in the most dangerous regions of the world. Gardner, these peacekeepers are
CTOS? Already? I'm looking at the network as we speak. You've got your access, and I've got mine. Profiler systems online. Everybody's nasty little secrets at the click of a button. This thing's highlighting all kinds of stuff in the district. I could take advantage of some of this. Keep an eye out for online traffic. Could be fixers in the network. If I can see them, they can see me. All right, I gotta move. I mean, a lot of noise here. Give me time to track your caller. I'll be in touch. If I trace his signal back, I'll find him before he breaches my phone. Now, how many more are out there? 
I can deal with Jackie's job as some kind of driving contract. A guy somewhere. This won't be a typical taxi service. The trick with these jobs is avoiding the cops. managed to interrupt a nighttime invasion on a manufacturing plant. One assailant died at the scene, while one remains at large. Expect a late... This is squad. We've got a green light on CTOS search. Scanning for suspect now. Squad, all units initiating CTOS... Shit. All units, be advised. Squad is beginning CTOS scan for suspect. Watch all units, CTOS scan initiated. Watch all units, initiating CTOS scan for suspects. I hope you have an invitation or you're dead. I'm the driver. Fuck, man, what took you so long? You got a car, this thing's shot to hell. No. Nope. My rule's your car. That's the job. All right, well, come on, man, let's go. Follow the route and keep an eye out. The cops are still searching. Your route's gonna get us killed. Sit back and keep quiet. Just stick to the plan. I know what I'm doing. That how your buddy wound up dead. Keep your head down. Uh, squad, we're gonna work the alleys. Copy that. All surrounding bridges are still up except the wells. You've got support inbound on the wells. Plan. Talk to me. You need to calm down. You got the island locked up. We'll stick to the back alleys, garages, keep out of sight. If you see me kill the engine and cut the lights, you keep quiet. Just be an old parked car. Understand? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Shit. My hands won't stop shaking. You ever seen a guy shot in the guts before? Too many. Oh, fuck, man. They said you were good. You did it. Some guys, just don't fuck it up now. What the fuck? That's Lucky Quinn. Why is the club boss meeting us? He's not meeting us. He's meeting you. Someone new. I swear, I don't know what happened. There wasn't supposed to be anybody. I, I mean, it's a computer plant, right? I turn around, the alarm's going off. The cops got there so fast. <laughs> I didn't... Shh. Quiet now. It's all over, son. I got it, Elise, right? That's what matters. It is indeed what matters most. This is how the world turns. Not much room for fuck-ups. Oh, oh, I get that, Mr. Quinn. I do. It wasn't my fuck-up, dog. Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah, well, calm now. It's all right. Calm? Get a chance to talk to your mama? 
Call your friends? Your girl? No, sir. I was in a hurry. That's good. Very good. Mr. Quimper! Oh! Tell your employer I'll call again. If ever I need a, another delivery. Lucky fucking Quinn. He runs the Chicago South Club. These assholes have been preying on Chicago since before I was born. I could have done the city a huge favor if I put one between his eyes. But this is exactly what I've been trying to stay away from. It always comes back hard. That can't happen again. Hey, how'd it go? You finished that job yet? You thought I'd be okay working for the fucking club? A paycheck is a paycheck. You gotta start separating the morals from the moolah. Relax. Listen, I can hook you up with my guy. He'll find you better driving gigs if you want. Yeah, sure. I don't know if I'll take them. Give him my name. Who says no to extra cash, right? Oh, and since you asked, Maurice is doing just fine in his new home. I've got something for you. We need to meet. Meet? What, face to face? Should I look for a guy in a mask? No mask. Just follow my signal. I thought you never wanted to meet. I don't. But we need to meet. segment, Power Profiles. Today we're exploring the life of Dermot Lucky Quinn. Quinn is... I'm hired bad boy before and he's always protected his identity. That's how DedSec works. He wants to meet. That's unusual. All right, I'm gonna try and shake him off his game. Let's see what he's up to. Bad boy. What? Bad boy, 17. What the fuck, man? Bad boy, 17? Clara. Clara. You don't look 17. <sighs> Do I look like a bad boy? No, you look like a wild card. I hope I don't frighten you. What, do you have a reason to frighten me? No, you're being paranoid. Am I? Someone is fucking with my life. Threatening my family, and at the same moment, the mysterious bad boy wants to meet me, and he is a she. He is a lie. Listen, I need to trust you, Clara. 
I wouldn't trust me if I were you. But here's a reason to listen. The text message you sent me? I know where to find him. Yeah. Well, we don't need to meet face to face for that. No. We needed a face to face for this. You wanted that sex of some axe? You got me in. You should be nicer to me. I'm about to open your world. Yeah. Well, you're not the first woman to promise me that. Mm. They do all their nasty work through this. And they don't know I have access. Well, you stole it. <laughs> this is powerful. Just don't be stupid. You screw around and you get me murdered. Worst. Hmm. Well, I don't think you trust me. Give me a reason to trust you. All right. The guy who sent the text, how do we find him? We work together. You with everything I just sent. Me, tracking his signal. You're not quite what I expected. And you're exactly as I expected, Aiden. Check out where they take deliveries. Looks like underground. In the tunnel. I'll start there. Hey, I'm sorry I was huh? rough before. I know what you were doing. Trying to intimidate me. Very tight. <gasps> Stepping into my personal space, the stair, physical contact. You are trying to look for cracks. So did you find any? What do you want oh. to know? <laughs> that sounds familiar. What am I seeing over there? Shit! We need to find him. You hear me? <gasps> Careful! Don't see anything. Get to move on. a wide open indoor plaza. More guards, no doubt. Call oh, those hacks I uploaded to your phone. It's a perfect distraction. You can disrupt them. Hack their phones, earpieces, explosives. Everything runs off computer chips these days. Okay, I'll try it. Can you scan me the offices? Find me someone with a nice secure laptop. Bradley Coughlin.
bullshit. It's go for cover. Oh, <laughs> I'm telling you, it's not just an ad. It blocks my entire view. Just one enormous oh, shit. Someone's hacked in. Oh fuck me. Lock down the building. Find him now. Okay, I got you in. Can you track the caller? Searching now. Carly. The police are coming. They've got high-tech scans that are hard to shake. You need to get out of there. clear fast enough. Does DedSec know a way to jam their scans? Wait. I think we do. Here it is. I'm sending it to you. Got a gun! was made from an apartment in the loop. Finally. Just be careful, Aiden. The way he bounced the signal around, I think he wants you to find him. Well, I certainly don't want to disappoint him. So this guy threatens my family and wants to meet. He knew exactly how to get my attention. Fine. I'll take the bait.
puzzles are split. There must be two CTOS boxes. Find me. You always were one for a mystery. How are you, Aiden? Damien Branks. The hell is he doing? I hope you don't mind the games. Wanted to see if you'd lost your edge. We need to talk. And, uh, you'll want to be quick. Breaking in like you did tripped an alarm. This isn't what I had planned for us. But we're about to be interrupted. Come find me. I'll pick someplace nice. Why would he harass my sister? We haven't spoken since the Merlot. Looks like there's a new target for all you hitters out there. Drop what you're doing and get on it. Damien, let's talk. It's all about out. 
A clever boy. Drinks on me. Damien. <clears throat> Tell me you miss me. You had that punk call my sister. Why am I here, Damien? You're always so grim, Aiden. <laughs> my God. Don't you ever loosen up? I want my partner back. Me at the computer. You in the field doing the manly work. I'm here to help you. We both want the same things. Answers? Who attacked us? And I happen to know that you've hit a wall. Yeah, I figured. So, I come bearing glad tidings. The Merlot. The Merlot? Mm hmm The Merlot was your fuck-up. Bullshit. You bailed on a perfectly good scheme. No one would have found out if you just stood by me. Six-year-old girl. My niece died because you went too far. Oh, you're adorable. Blaming your family problems on me? Damien crossed the line. He made the bad man angry. What about me? What about you? You're not the only one suffering. They made me a cripple. They took everything from me. Don't you see? That's what binds us together. You got nothing I need. There was another hacker. There was a second hacker. And I know how to find him. And that may be, Damien. But you can't do it on your own. You need me. Your big problem is... I don't need you. Don't walk away. This is a lead. Thanks for the tip. I used to look up to Damien. Taught me how to ferret out weak code and exploit it. And I taught him how to do the same without a computer. People can be more vulnerable than their systems. We were a strong team. After Lena, I was done with him. I didn't waste time thinking about him. But now he's creeping back in. I need to know what he's got on the Merlot. Who keeps leaving the flowers? No. But that girl has a lot of friends. Had. This is about letting go. I know. We've all suffered a horrible nightmare, but you have to stop trying to fix it. I'm not trying to fix anything. Aiden. I know what you're doing. I know you're chasing after the people that did this. When you do that, you put us all in danger again. You are not in danger. Because I protect you. Do you hear yourself? Aiden, why can't you stop? Because... I need to know. You are my brother, and I love you. 
But Jackson is my world, and I will keep you away in a second before I let him get hurt. Promise me you will stop. You can't save Lena. I killed her. No, you didn't. I don't blame you. But promise me you will stop. We need this. As a family. I promise. Jordy can be a pain to work with. He's the devil I know. Things were different. I might be hunting him down. Or vice versa. But if he says we got a problem, I need to take it as a massive understatement. Can't let the survivor ID me. Everything's gonna spiral out of control. buildings is pretty tight so people like this feel nice and secure living way up here i mean these people just had a, a simple chain lock on their door i guess they want to have a good look at the pizza guy before they open it all the way all right fine sure so about this problem well that's why i brought the bolt cutters he opens the door this much there's a chain right there i slip him in and snip and guess what it's not the pizza guy jordy the problem let's deal with it we are dealing with it we're in the midst of solutions here, Pierce. You don't appreciate what I do for you. You don't realize how much I take care of you, do you? Really? Yeah. Well, do me a favor. Let's get on with it. How much time do we have? Not as much as we need. Oh, you remember the stiff from the stadium? He's not so stiff anymore. The uh, cops got him in Chicago lockup, and oh, he's about to walk into an interrogation and point a finger. Right at you. How did that happen? Kick me when I'm down. Look at the view. See there? Call went out this morning. Somebody's paying buku bucks to grab this clown and make him talk. And one of those guys is running the assignment. Well, it seems like me and him need to have a little chat. Yeah, but this time, don't do that empty gun thing. Poor Maurice pissed himself after your last show. Don't worry about my methods. You know how to use that thing? Just get your ass down there, I got you covered. And don't kill the boss this time. You kinda need him. You think? Let's make this quick, okay? My balcony hosts are moaning, and that stuff gives me migraines. I get a migraine, Pierce. I am useless to you. You think you're the only one who wants this quick? How should I know what you want? Not big on empathy, are you? Not particularly. What's up with this fixer contract? What are they looking for? You? Some 
Somebody wants to vigilante big time. They're about to fake a prisoner transfer to bust out the one witness who can ID you. I've never seen them gather up this kind of manpower, though. You know, I'll try and stop them. Listen, the witness knows my face. If the fixers reach him, if my name gets out there, they'll come after my family. Ah, the F word. You're too sentimental, Pierce. That's a weakness. Somebody's gonna play that against you someday. I'll cover you where I can, but I can't see everybody. All right, let's do this. Watch out, you got a fan. Oh, shit. I know that guy. Which one? I always forget his name. The guy with the ears. The, the Dooley Dawson. Is he a friend? I don't really have friends. Duncan might be a B name. You have no idea who he is. Oh, uh, well, guess not. I'm taking him out. Douglas! What? That was his name, Douglas. Ah, oh, shit. Too late. You shot him. I couldn't remember his name. That sucks. I like that guy. Had a lot of rabbi jokes. Fuck me if I can remember a single one of them. Do you think you could enjoy yourself a little less? Choose a job you love, and you never have to work a day in your life. is inside that office. Hold on. Hold on. Stop. Who's the sign of prison jail? What? Man, I don't know what you're talking about. Lance Brenner. It's a family. What are you doing? I'm asking you how your family is. Looks like you got two lives going at once. Family man. Yeah, the kids are gonna be in college soon. It's pricey for a union rep. Fuck you. Yeah, and there's also the second life. Ghost accounts with a lot of money in them. Hey. Do you know that your name is tied to a whole bunch of cold cases? I bet the cops would love a chat. Okay, hold on. You want a piece of the cash? I can cut you in. You're wasting my time. All right, all right! Fuck. Prison job. It's Angelo Tucci. He's running a convoy. It's too late. You'll never find him. He says I want him. I bet he's got a family in town. Why do you want his family? What the fuck is wrong with you? I wouldn't know where to begin. There's more fixtures incoming. How bad? Remember Kinderhook? Shit. There he is. I got him.
Never called me back. Did you find the guy we traced? Yeah. Some bad history there. Listen, I need to find someone else. This time I have a name, Helena Tucci. She's related to a guy I'm after. Does she live in Chicago? Yeah. I need a location right now. Got her. Wow. She's got a serious digital footprint. Okay. This morning she posted about a meeting today outside the Willis Tower. All right. I'll call you when I'm there. May need more help. <laughs> Great, that's what this city needs. <laughs> okay, I'm at the Willis Tower. What do you got on Helena? Looking through his status updates. She likes selfies. Here she is making a duck face, a spiral face. She loves her cats too. Why are you targeting this clueless girl? I'm not. I need to find her uncle fast, and Helena's gonna point the way. Over 70% off. Everything must go. The economy's lost. Your game. Again, come on, yeah. Okay, here's something. She posted a pic this morning. Her outfit for the day. Dark hair and glasses. And she's showing off a green backpack. Thank you, social media. That's a start. I'll keep digging. Okay. It's called deodorant. Hello? Miss Tucci? I'm Dr. Hyatt with the Chicago General Hospital. We received your Uncle Angelo's blood work, but you're the only number he gave us. Do you know where we can reach him? It's urgent. 
No, sorry. I haven't heard from my uncle in years. Okay, thank you, man. Wait for it. Yeah. Hey, Uncle Angie. Elena! You need concert tickets again? No, listen. I got a weird call. I think the cops are looking for you. What? Damn it, you calling me just gave them a trace. Hang up now. Gotcha. Where are you, Angelo Tucci? There you are. Angelo Tucci. This guy's leading the prison transfer for my witness. Somebody's paying Tucci for the vigilante's identity. <gasps> Somebody wants my name. Well, good luck with that. <gasps> Tracking his GPS. Cut him off before he reaches the prison. Nice. face with my witness. You get arrested. Of course you are. Why the hell are you doing that? This witness we're after, he's a nobody. He was in the wrong place at the wrong time. He wasn't looking for me. I don't want to kill him. I just want him to understand I can reach him anywhere, anytime. That is a terrible plan. I love it. I'll find a map of the joint. Talk you through it once you're inside. Anything you need? My phone? Jesus, you have a problem you need to unplug. Jordy, I need my phone. They'll confiscate it the second I'm in. Yeah, I know. I'm fucking with you. <laughs> I got just a guy. He's begging to settle his debt. Just get your phone. Palin Correctional Center. They recently upgraded the place with Bloom's state-of-the-art security. 
Network locks, automated surveillance. If they were holding the guy in an older prison, I'd have a problem. But Bloom's right on this one. They do make life easier through technology. Jordy, we're even now. Don't move. Pierce. Aiden. Smith! I already told you, man. You ain't ever gonna find it until it's stuck between your shoulder blades. Yeah, yeah, get in there. I got 20 minutes of rec time, motherfucker. Jordy, I found the schedule. Where's the exercise yard? Up top. Mark, he's up here somewhere. Quinn doesn't want to take any chances. <laughs> oh, shit, man. How do I get in on that? Why don't they shoot each other? Oh, fool. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> and they was like, blood, man, this ain't right. Come by that shit either. Somebody set up an execution. Man, it was that stupid, though. I got a theory, son. Nah, man. You need to stop worrying about that, dude. He ain't real. Change your plan. Our prisoner transfer was a bust, so your plan B. What do you need us to do? Whatever it takes to get this guy talking. You got it.
though. No, I didn't get you off the roof. Hey, who says I have to be moved? Who are you guys? Hey, what about my lawyer? Where, you, where are we going? Answer Jeez, me! Sir, you show me will the you paperwork! Shut up. Where's my lawyer? We're taking you to your no. lawyer. No way! Right after we clean you, what are you up gonna do? first. I ain't going with a Shut bunch of crooked the fuck fuck up. Damn. Better reach him fast before they kill him. There's quite the little crooked operation being run out of this joint. Look at you bringing justice back to the prison system. Door's empty. Door's wide open. No silent alarms have gone off. Watch your back. What's a couple of bottom feeders doing at the state? Doing a deal without cutting us in? Think we don't have friends? Doing at the state. Doing a deal without cutting us in? Think we don't have friends in high places? They expect to cut too. No! Watch your back! I'm in on his side. Move! Whoa. I need backup now! Uh. Uh. Shit! Where the hell is my backup? I'm in trouble here! Get back in cover! <laughs> it's time to perforate this asshole. Tech security prisons. They make it quite easy, really. Have we met? What? Have we met? Uh, no. No, I never seen you, man. Mm. Yeah, I didn't think so. So you're in here for sixty days. Good behavior. You're out in thirty. <laughs> That's it. 
60 years? What are you doing, man? I'm just showing you an alternate future. You know, in case you get the urge to share your stories or make a deal with the cops. We're clear, right? All units possible prison escape. Be on the lookout for white male, Joe Smith. I need a unit up to the laundry. We've lost communication. Copy. We're on it. Marty, it's done. Fantastic. I'm guessing you're eager to get out of there. There's a care package on its way for you. Where? Don't worry, you'll see it. about a second hacker. Someone else inside the Merlot. Need to find out what Damien knows. Aiden, we had a very unpleasant meeting. Well, I didn't kill you. We used to get along. I taught you so much. Look at you, big time hacker now. Is that you in the news? The vigilante? You mentioned the second hacker at the Merlot job. But we already knew there was another hacker. You found something new. Ah, intriguing, isn't it? Come, let's meet and I'll explain. Tell me. Then I'll consider meeting. Oh, no. My information, my rules. Besides, we need to make up for last time. I'm very excited, Aiden. Come soon. I need to make this quick. Damien's pride is his weak spot. Just... Play it up. Commits him to say what he knows. Then drop him. He's too reckless. He's too dangerous. Where are you? I don't think you're gonna like
like my answer. You know what? Forget it. I don't need whatever you got. Brought me nothing but trouble. We're done talking. Oh, too late, Aiden. <laughs> you won't believe where I am. Never mind, I'll send you the feed. Find a TV and have a look. That's Nikki's house. What are you doing? You should hurry, my boy. Your pretty sister needs you. Damien! Excuse you. Damien, what are you doing? Did you not see me? Son of a bitch played me and I let him. What's he doing at Nikki's? No, he won't hurt them. I'll kill him if he touches them. No, he has to know that. No, he's trying to draw me there. He wants me to work with him. Find the guys who attacked us? Fuck that. I need to take him down. Just hang in there, guys. I'm coming. Six years old. It's tragic. Where are they? Such a waste. All of this. It's such a waste. You know, the real tragedy here is that somebody like you was surrounded by so many fragile things. It makes you fragile. Ah! Where? That, that's not how it works. You don't want to answer that. Yeah. Aiden! Nikki, where are you? <coughs> Nikki! <coughs> Stop and think. You fuck around and she is dead. <coughs> this isn't how I wanted it. But this is where we are. If you'd listen to me, things would be different. Just tell me where they are. Where they are? There's only Nikki. That little boy. I don't know where he is. Now, this is what's gonna happen. I point to a hard drive. I told you there was another hacker. That will lead you to his computer. Get it? And you'll find out who ordered the hit on us. What do you really want? You lost your right to question me. I want that hard drive. That's all you need to know. And that's the price for Nikki. Stop overthinking, Aiden. I'll need regular updates. In exchange, you get to talk to Sis. Quit pro and all that. This won't end well for you. Perhaps, but don't get clever. I really have no problem killing that girl. We'll talk soon, partner. Where is Jax? Damien doesn't have him. I hope he's got his tablet. There. He's on the L. Oh, shit. Someone's after him. There you are. I was worried. The dead sack hacks you gave me. Can I control the L? The train? Yes, but... I need that right now. How do I do it? It's locked. Hold on. I'm sending something. It's a zero-day exploit. The trains won't recognize the hack, but it only works once. Send it now. It's sent. What happened, Aiden? I don't have time. Meet me at the Al Motel later, okay? I can't reach him in time. All right, hack the train. Get Jackson moving and away from these guys. Kids here somewhere. All right, that's bought me time. Make the next station. Hold on, kiddo. Train's leaving. Shh. 
shit! All right, get to the next station. Go! Go! Somebody's on us! Who is this guy? Try to ditch him if you can! Oh! Jax. You're safe now. All right, you're safe. Okay, listen. This is important. Back at the house, did you hear those men say anything? Come on, Jax, talk to me. All right. We're gonna find your mom. Speaking? Yolanda, hi. This is Aiden Pierce, Nikki's brother. Is everything all right? It'd be great if we could meet in person. I'm on the train with Jax. All right. Uh, do you know where Nikki drops him off? Yeah, we'll meet you there. Mm -hmm. I need you to be brave for me, okay? Men at the house said this? This is good, Jax. It's good. Hey! Hello, sweetheart. What's going on, Mr. Pierce? Where's Nikki? Yeah, it's been a rough week. She's forced herself to get rid of Lena's stuff. And, uh, I think she's finally saying her goodbyes. How bad is it? It's bad. She should call me. Well, she wanted me to call you. See, we we're wondering if you could look after Jax for a few days. We'll pay you, of course. Of course. I'll help in any way I can. That'd be great. Thank you. 
Nikki needs to grieve. I know it's hard, but it's a good thing. It's been rough. We're gonna work it out. Right? Hey, little man. We're gonna cause some trouble. Huh. Let's go. neighborhood. I need to be prepared. How's it going? What can I get you? What are you looking for? Authorities you at Chicago Correctional Center are triple checking their security protocols today after a prison break. Thanks Facts for the purchase. Sketchy, but we do know that at least one person... Racine. Let's see where that is. Gotcha, Robert Racine. Someone here was hired by Damien. Start with the owner, Robert Racine. Just work your way down. Stay cool. Just keep your head.
to go for the kid. Did you think I'd actually pay you more? Now you've complicated things. Who's this guy after me? Did you send him? <laughs> I didn't send him, but I probably should have warned you about Aiden. You gotta help me, or I I'll tell him everything I know. That's exactly why you don't know anything. He's not gonna be happy when he finds that out. Fuck, man, what do I do? Whatever you can. Good luck.
You're just wasting my time. Damien's all ego. He needs this victory. I'll give it to him. Find that second hacker and you'll let Nikki go. Do I believe that? Doesn't matter. Right now, I got no other options. Son of a bitch. Fucking Marla job. All right, Damien. Let's see if there's something you missed. Right there. Damn it. What the? Hey, it's me. You called me here. Shit. I have a lot on my mind. Yeah? Okay, come here. Take a look at this. Who is she? I don't know. The file's corrupt. You have any ideas how to make the video play? This isn't fixable. You need the original. I'm running a search on your CTOS access. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. See, I don't think he knows about this. He would have bragged. I know him. Who would have bragged? She might be a lead. Or not. I gotta stay a step ahead of him. Are you in trouble? An IP address. Yeah, you gave that to me. Can you find where that leads? What is all of this? Aiden, answer me. I'm not doing anything until... He took her, Clara. He, he, he's using my sister as collateral. Oh, my God. The man we traced? Yeah. Damien. Damien Brinks. Uh, I can't help you. I'm gonna go. We'll talk later, right? After you're done. Shh, shh, shh. This way. We could use some help. What did they want?
we hit on. Just stay low. I'll get us out. Go, get in the car. I'll finish here. What are you doing? Just go! They're going to trap us! Crazy, he won't hurt you. Just be careful. What do you mean you know him? He kidnapped me. He's trying to get to me through you. What? Time's up. My God, what did he say to her? The poor girl in tears. Damien, put her back on. Do you want to continue this little chat? You follow that IP address and get me something I can use. Ta ta. All right, she's safe. Now she's somewhere cold, maybe outdoors. I'll keep her talking, and maybe I can find where she is. drives, my network access. All right, I need to get back online. Where's Clara? Be careful, Aiden. Don't pull her into this. Here. Thanks. Those men, who are they? I don't know. You know, they must have picked up on the CTOS search. That's why I wanted to see you. DeadSec says that someone else has the system hacked. I took it, and I gave it to you. Well, hold on. I didn't give it to anyone. I wouldn't. We need to trust each other. You know what? I don't have time to soothe you, Clara. If you don't trust me, there's nothing I can do. Someone shot up my motel room. My sister's gone, and I have nothing. You are not my priority right now. No, I know that. Of course. Do you know this place? Somewhere near here. It's supposed to be the first test site for CTOS. It is known as the Bunker. At least, 
That's how the urban legend goes. A bunker? One with access to the entire city? Undetected access. I've done months of research on it. City planning, zoning documents, things they don't want us to see. There's a blank spot on every map. Right over there. Ish. And you've lost your damage deposit on the motel. It's fine. We need to find a way inside that bunker. Undetected access to the whole city. I could use a break right now. Somebody's been on that island recently. His name's Tobias Frewer. Tobias was one of the CTOS pioneers until Bloom fired him. The man is vraiment crazy. Or on drugs. Maybe both. He lives right near here. There's a homeless camp. He's homeless? He's got an underground shop hidden in there. Deadsec goes there for some of the more rare hardware. He can forget him. He's paranoid and won't talk. I can be persuasive. I'll let you do the talking. You really want this place to be real, don't you? It is real. So you're buying into the legend. Papa used to take me camping in Mont Tremblant. He'd always say we were looking for treasure. I didn't understand then that he was stealing from the cabins. Gold watches, tools. The look on his face when it was something special. Like one time, I found an old rusted coin with a regal emperor. He said it was an ancient Roman coin, priceless. But he let me keep it. Said it was my door to a magic <laughs> world, the whole Roman Empire. I guess I am a fighter's daughter. Stars in my eyes. Well, I hope this bunker is real too. It's real. Shootout erupted at the Owl Motel earlier, resulting in a gas main explosion. No reports on casualties. Police are investigating. Officials say thanks to the rapid response CTOS network. There. That's where Tobias runs his shop. Mostly black market junk. Sometimes you can find rare schematics, if you're lucky. He's not there. What now? Someone here knows how to reach him. I'll never look around. at your shop well it's closed wait what do they look like i don't know man punk rock chick and a then it's closed he's playing poker i'll get them to deal me in poker game huh let's see where you're hiding there we go hold on what's this someone else is tracking the call it's gotta be fixers. Hey, you're not gonna believe this. I finally got a lock on Frewer. I'm going to pick him up now. There they are. They'll hunt him down fast. I need to stop them. You were right. He's paranoid. But I found him. You wanna go alone, don't you? All right. 
Legal poker out here. Who'd suspect? One of these guys is Tobias. Who are you? I don't know you. I, I, I don't know him. Relax. Are you Tobias? None of your business. I'll take that as a yes. N no, take it as none of your business. That's a nice attitude. Is that why Bloom fired you?
It ain't me you want. find out I'm not one of them why should I trust you because I could shoot you and take it oh that ain't an answer man all right I don't work with whoever you think no one needs to know about this conversation no power to the bunker they cut it there's no power, do you get it? Might as well call that place a tomb. All right. I can deal with that. That's all it ever was when you think about it. A tomb. Anyone that ever touched that fucking place. We all have one foot in the grave, but I, I'm okay. I'm safe here. Mostly. Sure. The bias. May I have the bridge remote? Please? I built it, you know. The remote. Yeah. That's what I do, I build. That's great. Let me have it. Yeah. Fine. Sure. Well, yeah, you take it. Great. Yeah, it's your funeral. That's heavy, huh? <laughs> Trust me, man. It only gets heavier. Hey, listen. You need anything? I mean, whatever. You come see me. I build stuff. You do. was pretty spooked by it. I'm not interested in the myth. And if it helps me get Nikki, then I'll use it. Did you find Tobias? I did. And? We played poker, had a nice talk. What did he say? Clara, it's real. I told you. Don't go in without me. I'm on my way. Don't worry. I still have to restore the power, and then we have to find an entrance. I'll see you soon. Your car. How much of it did 
you have to take apart to find my flash drive? Did you find all six decoys? The ball's in your court now. I just want to point out that I've already done the car thing, so you can leave my baby alone. to go. I just heard the generator kick on. It's gonna need more juice than this. Can you look for an entrance? How would Bloom hide a place like this? I hope there's a secret elevator. You pull a switch and the floor drops into a hidden base deep underground. Underwater? We're on an island. Wishful thinking. Up then. One of the buildings. I'll keep looking. there. Once we're in, can you get us online? In my circle, this is the fine of the century. If I fuck it up, it can take away my hacker card. And do you actually have a hacker card? Get us inside. Maybe I'll show it to you someday. I'm working on it. Generators are back there. I'll just hack the gate.
found it. I just heard the system come back online. Wait for me. Why? It's perfectly safe. Nobody's been inside for years. Because I want to see your face when the door opens. <laughs> Sweet home. Hmm. See? I was right. DeadSec would make good use of this. Clara, we need to make a deal here. No one can know about this. At least until after I'm done with it. Of course. Help me get her online. Fingers crossed. Most of the hardware, but it should be some really important part. Voila. Can we be traced from here? This is a secure site. By design, it's untraceable, unhackable. Yet here we are about to hack it. I need to know where this IP address comes from. Let me see. What's special about it? It's just a lead, that's all. How did Damien find this? This is pretty well hidden. Doesn't leave any doors open. It looks like it's coming from the Rossi Freeman district. Mm -hmm. Viceroy territory. There. Surveillance. You can use those to get a peek inside. Can you connect from here? No. They're completely off the grid. This is bizarre. Well, if I can't connect from here, I'm gonna connect at the source. I'll have you up and running before you're back.
CTOS recording your every waking moment. <laughs> the public has no idea. see Fremont. They had such big hopes for this place. All that did was bring the gangs together under one roof. Loyalty to your neighborhood just became loyalty to your housing block. What about everybody else? They got in line, or they got out. I'm gonna take a look around, try and figure out what they've been up to. Damien's IP points somewhere in there. These guys are running a place like a fortress. I'll never break the wall. Tap into their network, and we can get a look inside. Fuck 
Get in there, find some answers, and get my sister back. And once you get your answers, what then? Then I find out who did this, and I make sure they answer for it. Every single person involved in Lena's death. You still there? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. Okay, I'll see you soon. Tobias, <laughs> how did you get this number? Vigilante. That's a dangerous accusation. Yeah, there's the vigilante voice. It scared the shit out of me the first time I heard it. Listen, I got something that might interest somebody like you. I found out the police are busy putting more guns on the streets. What are you talking about? I've been listening in. They're selling crates full of a man undercover. And then? You have what you need. So far, yeah. Okay, look, I, I, I understand if you're scared. I'm not scared. No one asked me to stay. Right, well, no one asked you to leave. You'll need to do better than that. <clears throat> I could use some help. I could use your help. Like a team? Sure, like a team. Not used to being a team. No, I'm not. 
Was that so hard? No. Let's go then. Sure. All right. Let's dive in and see what we can find. It's in here on the top floors. How do we get there? We ride the cameras. <sighs> where, where is he? Come on, man. Like, I need to see him. I need to see him. Look at that. We got the whole place custom wired. We got typical game bangers. like a fortress. I don't see an easy way in. You've done this before. I admit nothing. See that part there? Stick the skimmer in that spot. Dismiss the person's car. Send it back to us on Wi-Fi. Got it. It's a good thing it doesn't take much to modify this shit, man. We're gonna have to update these machines from the chip car. Don't worry about that. We got it covered. We're more on top of shit than any law. Like Iraq says, adapt to change. That's the key, man. There. 
The IP address is coming from that room. There's a card reader on it. Shit. Key's hidden in this dog tag. Listen, ain't nobody stole from you, boy. Get your boss on the phone. Yeah, it'll take a few. It'll fucking take a few. Man, but get your ass in here. What are you doing with that? I thought I told you. I just thought that you... Man, this shit won't fly. You remember Grandma's poor dog? That ugly little fox. Fat head. <laughs> Always came running when you hollered for him, bro. <laughs> but I always kept pissing on the floor, too. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, you, you don't. Listen. It cost me business. And who do you think's gonna win? Between you and business. Yeah, I, Mr. Quinn's on speaker. Business. Quinn. I put you in charge of merchandise and security. Now I find you still on my guest list. I won't be fleeced, Mr. Iraq. Yo, chill. It ain't how it went down. See, I think you're confused. This is a business collaboration. Your guests are my guests. Listen, we'll talk this out at the auction. Don't I... be a stoked, Mr. Iraq. Where I grew up, we shot them between the eyes. Fucking leprechaun can suck my lucky charm. This fuck's a stoked. <laughs> Yo, it's, it's a weasel, man. <laughs> weasel! <laughs> I don't see how you could get on the compound. Never mind near that room. Even the security locks on the doors are encrypted. That fat kid, Bedbud, he's gonna go in for me. Just like that? And why should he help us? I'm betting he's one mistake away from a bullet to the head. So when he makes that mistake, I'll be reporting. Nothing like blackmail to change someone's tune. Complicated. If I can keep Damien focused on that hard drive, I can find Nikki. He'll slip up. I know Damien. I have to be patient. And right now, I need bed bug. I read the news today. Something about a high-speed chase near Parker Square had all the hallmarks of Aiden Pierce. Are you with Nikki? Of course. We read it together, and I highlighted all your signature moves. She was quite alarmed. She doesn't seem to know you like I do. Just get her on the phone. Now, now. The IP address. Yeah. There's something inside Rossi Fremont, some kind of small server hidden behind a locked door. And an army of gangbangers. Now you understand why I need your help. Have you found a way in? I'm working on it. Let me talk to Nikki. Was that so painful? Aiden. Hey. We're getting close. He'll be home soon. What's going on? This guy talks like you two are friends. We're not friends. Not anymore. Nikki, just don't listen to his bullshit. You afraid he'll give up your secrets? I got no secrets. <laughs> Seriously, Aiden? You expect me to believe that? I'm your sister. Well, shouldn't my sister be cutting me a little slack? Really? Oh, because I'm being held by your friend and you need a little slack. Well, it sounds worse when you say it like that. 
Ever hurt your feelings? I forget what a sensitive boy you are. You know me. Heart on my sleeve. Fun's over, kids. I hope your plan's a good one. Nikki does too. I'm taking a gamble with Ben Bun, but I have a hunch he's my perfect target. He doesn't have much, has a lot to lose, easily intimidated, and ambitious, but lazy. All right, start with his home, tap his cell phone, just record everything he says. I want to keep you where you are. <laughs> now, listen up, for real. Uh, yeah, you want to move up? I ain't supposed to say nothing, but a rag been moving weight up in Parker Square. I'll talk to him. He might be able to cut you in. Damn, B, not so loud. Himself. I know, because I helped him bury the bodies. Man, don't say that shit out loud, son. You know your fan paranoid about that shit getting back to him? I'll say whatever I want. What? Are you paranoid, too? Only when I'm around your ass, fam. There. That's the blackmail I'm after. Rack hears this little gem and Bedbug will be buried in a landfill.
walking down the hood. Might as well call the popo yourself. Nah, they don't come out here no more. Not here. Nobody give a shit about this place. It ain't right, man. It's the way I see it, they gave it to us. It's our shit. We the police now. <laughs> you have the right to suck my dick. <laughs> man, you nuts. You have the right to shut the fuck up, motherfucker. Better stop looking, girl. You <laughs> respect the law. <laughs> Man, kid wasn't even banging. Shot down in front of his mom. Got the cards? Yeah, B. Then numbers two? Yeah, they in there. What about Iraq's cut? Don't worry about Iraq. Worry about me. What's up? Got something you want to hear, bug. Trust me. So, tell me. I'm not here, fam. It's me. You got that dough on you? Always. Why? <laughs> no, this is this gonna cost you. But it's worth it. Trust me. And yeah, we'll see about that. I'm out. 
Humvees to this right. No way, cuz. guy who just saved your ass, and I can do a lot more if you cooperate. What are the bricks? Look, look, just get me out of here, man, and I'll tell you. All right, pay attention. I heard something. Yeah, it's all ready to roll. Now, you get him to the brick factory, my boys, and kill him quick. And I know he's a friend, so this is a test. You do what I ask, and you'll get a reward. Shit. Iraq's put a kill command on Bedbug. I need to show up in this place and deal with these guys. Yo, don't let your guard down. Stay on your guard, dude! <laughs> hey, yo, he's on! These foot soldiers don't mean anything to Iraq. The weak link is no place in a gang. I've seen this happen to a few guys. They don't pull their weight and they get torn down hard. But if Bedbug can survive it, show he's got what it takes, Iraq won't just save face, he'll embrace the kid. Show him off. What is that? Come around back and find out. <sighs> I told you. I was bringing the boys. Ah, oh, Jesus. I thought you meant the explosives. Then I would have said I was bringing the girls. But I brought that too. No, I need some help. I was hoping you could involve these guys in a gangland shooting of some sort. I got a few loose ends I need to tie up and, you know, you do owe me those favors. I don't owe you anything. Give me the explosive, something I can carry. Fine. These two nutsacks are some unfinished business from a Gabonese job. You should have seen the way that they tried to take me out. I am driving this beast of a muscle car right out of the 70s. You know when an automobile accident was still called a fucking car crash? Let's go. Yeah, so these geniuses here think they're gonna ram me off the road with some plastic, eco-friendly shit bug. It just makes this weird ping. Bounces off into a park van. Here, hold that. Great. <clears throat> Thanks. This is what I have for you. It's a uh, sticky bomb. See? It sticks. Cool, huh? Hmm. So these two idiots are sitting in their car moaning and whining. They're all fucked up. I don't know whether to laugh at them or scream at them. Finally, I just pulled out my 45 and slammed a couple of rounds into their fat faces. So that's what I have. Do you deal with all this for me? No way. We could just do that. Do that. Yeah, it's like a like a practice round. What do you think, fellas? Practice round? Jordy. I don't need a practice round. No, just let me get a little clearer. Jordy. Fuck.
You didn't blow yourself up. <laughs> Not yet. Just trying to figure out where these guys meet so I can have some surprises waiting for them. Ooh, booby traps, fun. Deals right here. More tire tracks. And the car's coming from both ends. Tire tracks. Someone's regular parking spot.
Your friends can't come to the phone right now. They're dead. The fuck? Hey, who's still standing? Anybody? Come on, man. He's getting away. He'll report to Iraq. Bedbugs as good as dead. he always wanted. Now, I need to scare him over to my side. A little blackmail threat should convince him to help me. Yeah. I give, yeah, but, wait. but I can also take away. Listen, bees. Nobody comes through here. I'm on the way. Uh, what hey, in the buddy. Lord's name you are you doing? You feeling okay, buddy? job for you. But it's not a job for Tyrone. It's a job for Bed Mud. I'll be in touch. Wait, but what, what is this? Now, come on, man! No way. Hey, somebody's after yeah. me. Uh -huh. They're all dead. You, sure did. You, you gotta get me out of here. <laughs> you fucked in the head, man. Yeah, listen to you. No, 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 wait, ahead, wait! Whatever, man. Shit! Yeah, I yeah. see. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Get in there. What the fuck? What about Iraq? Go! No, no, stop it! Uh, don't worry about Iraq. Worry about me. There. No. Sounds like you love me. What you want? my eyes and ears inside Rossi Fremont. Oh, no! No, no, wait, man. Iraq will kill me! Yeah. What will he do when I send him everything I've got? You want to see more? Yes. No! Just erase this shit, please! Well, you play along like a good little bug, and I will. I'll be in touch. Sounds like the club don't trust our... Yeah. Okay. Why you keep calling me, man? You gonna get me killed! Tell me how to get close to Iraq. Uh, 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 you ain't getting close to Iraq, man. Uh, forget it. He never comes out. You wanna rethink your answer? Uh, uh, wait, wait. Uh, the, the, the auction. Uh, he'll be at Quinn's auction. What kind of auction? Private. Yeah, like, like, uh, not your normal kind of auction. Uh, in invite only. So get me an invite. Who do you think I am? All right. All right. I'll be in touch. Be ready. How did it go? Did you find a way into IREX building? Yeah. Bedbug's on board and waiting for my call. Let's talk about the access card Iraq was wearing. That's our only way into his room. It's an RFID tag. We can clone it, but you need to get very close. Bedbug says Iraq's attending an auction. That's my chance. The auction, yes. Remember that briefcase Iraq had? Hard to forget. Crush the guy's skull with it. Right. 
He said it had the guest list inside. You can thank me now, because I've been tracking that case. Now let me check. That was quick thinking. If we get that briefcase, can you find me a name on the guest list? A name I can borrow. Exactly my thought. I'm sending the briefcase location now. I'll need to move carefully. If I can count on anything, Damien will be working at an angle. He's got another agenda. Okay, right now I need that briefcase. I do, it's moving. Wait, I can't believe it. What? Quinn's guys are pulling some old school gangster shit. A briefcase swap, really? Do those actually work? Never seen one of these. Why are they doing this? Did they fool CT on us? Anybody watching through a monitor would see every swap. They're trying to confuse the detection software. Interesting. Stay alert. Oh! Hey, buddy. No need to get. They got the case on a boat heading up river. I got a bike here. I'm gonna follow. Maybe I can see where they're going. Give me a sec. What do you have nearby? My guess, this will be a short trip. There's another drop for another pickup. Okay. Nope. Nope. Wait. There's an old marina bought by Lucky Quinn in 1967. That's gotta be it. Says it's been closed to the public since the 80s.
I know you're still here! I can smell this! Get down! Force him out. Head into his blind spot. Someone blow this asshole up. Where's the guest list from the case? Whatever this auction is. Oh. Oh. We're taking you. Okay, so we'll find you in two days. Not a regular. Someone from out of the country. A guy they won't recognize. Okay. We're so. Okay. This one. Can you pull off a Mr. Pang? I don't think so. Any Europeans? Nicholas Crispin. 32 years old, expat American, <coughs> hasn't been back in 12 years. That's the one. Oh my god. They list his preferences. This man is sick. And filthy rich, too. Will anyone miss him? What do you mean, miss him? Clara, if I'm stealing his identity, I can't have him around blowing my cover. I can't keep him alive. Oh. No, I guess not. My sister's missing, Clara. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get her. Listen, if this is too much for you, you can walk away. I'll understand. No, I'm fine. Nobody's going to miss this dog. This is a good match. He's supposed to pick up his car at the dealership. All right. I'll meet him there.
That's got it. Now Nicholas Crispin. Hi, this is Aiden, Jack's uncle. I want to make sure things are going okay there. First, I want to know if things are okay with Nikki. We haven't heard from her. She's still working things out. She just needs a little more time. Well, Jackson misses her terribly. She should at least give him a call. I can tell he's restless. He's not happy here. I understand. And I'll let her know. If you have any problems with Jax, anything at all, if he wanders off or anything, you call me right away. I will. You take care of that sister of yours. Yeah. I am. Forgetting Claire's not used to this. I'm gonna scare her off if I'm not careful. Crispin's my ticket into the auction, and my only shot at getting close to a rack. He needs to disappear. Mr. Quinn didn't know which color you'd like, so, um, you can take whichever. That one, All right? And get her ready for when I return. He must have a schedule or something on his phone. Can't let him get away. He must have a schedule or something on his phone. Can't let him get away.
Looks like Crispin was on his way to pick up something called the Poppy Special. It's at a club called Infinite 92. Infinite 92. No official listings. I see mention of it in some thread here. Oh, looks like it's a gentleman's fetish club. Underground, of course. So the Poppy Special is a woman. That fits the profile Quinn had on Crispin. I doubt Poppy would have survived the meeting. What kind of auction is this? I think we both know the answer to that. I'm going to the club now. Crispin's invite is there. Crispin's as fucked up as they say, I'm gonna draw attention. Just find the auction invite and get out. The poppy special. Very good, Mr. Crispin. A signature dish prepared especially for you. We'll hang on to any weapons. Mr. Crispin, right this way, please. What happened to the guards assigned to you, sir? They couldn't keep up. Mr. Quinn wanted to ensure you're comfortable. On his behalf, we offer you a special gift. Please, enjoy as much as you like. You're my special gift, eh? What's your name? Poppy? I know about you, what you do to girls. No, it's not. It's okay. I'm done. <laughs> Mr. Crispin, is everything to your liking? You interrupt me again and you're next. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just come with me. I can help you. No. They'll find me. They said you were a monster. You're not Crispin, are you? My name is Pierce. Hope you'll come back again. Look, I've got to 
I need a favor. I gotta get Poppy out of this place. Call Infinite 92, pretend you're Crispin's assistant. Tell them I insist that Poppy be delivered to me at the auction. Yes, okay. She'll be there. I'll make sure of it. Maybe Crispin had to die, but at least we can save this girl. That's something, right? I'm not sure we can add things up so cleanly, but we're gonna get her out. <gasps> Quinn's auction. Rack somewhere inside. Security's gonna be tight and it won't be long before someone reports my mess at the car dealers. Just find a rack, scan his dog tags, make a clean getaway. <laughs> Sounds easy enough. Something tells Sorry, me it's Christian. not gonna go down that Need way. Your weapon. Wouldn't want to be rude. Not a scratch. Mr. Quinn said you like to see the raw merchandise. I'd like to know what I'm paying for. I asked for my merchandise to be delivered here. Where can I find Poppy? Mr. Quinn got your request. Don't worry. She's here. I have to tell you Get Mr. Quinn's rules, together, though. Man. All payments must be made in cash or through a secured account. If you want to sample any of the girls before they're open to bidding, you got to pay a small fee. Premium girls are off limits. Don't want to lower the value if you get me. Yeah, I get you. Make sure it's a quiet night or we aren't going to be able to keep the other boys from shutting you down. Our clients are low-key. Yeah, yeah, why are the payment already? Being this close to gangbangers gives me a rash. Never mind. We'll also be done with them soon enough. Hey, I'll tell you something. No fucking yeah, way I'm going down for any of this shit you. if it ever gets leaked. This is Mr. Crispin. I'm taking him to meet Mr. Quinn. They won't bring all the merchandise on stage at once. So I'm scheduled a private show. Each one of them will be tagged with a number. It keeps things efficient. A few guests prefer to watch their monitor. I was told you want to see the stage. How else can I get a full appreciation of what you guys do? Step aside. Mr. Quinn's waiting. Mr. Quinn is up there with our rat. All clear, round back. Bids are still open. Bid was raised. Yo, I just got word for the boss. Any Some other of Quinn's bids guys got popped. Open. Something ain't right. He Everything's wants to double check all the IDs Final on everybody that comes bid. in. Triple check if you have to. Final Radio chatter's quiet so far. Keep an eye out. Sold. Case. Moving on to the next item on your tablets. All due respect, it's your man gonna miss it. This shit all risk now. Extra security we ain't enough. We should have canceled. The risk Another bit is allowing yourself to be seen as weak. Relax. Bids are still do what open. you have to do. Don't make a circus. Bid was raised. My men are stretched. Your men are expendable, Mr. O'Reilly. Any other bids, gentlemen? Business must proceed. In the meantime, Final call on this. Find out who killed my man. Final call. That's all. Sold. Moving Mr. on Chris. to the next item on your tablet. Would you excuse me? Of course. Our right, guest is arrived. Mr. Quinn, unfortunately, I can't stay. Enjoying our little pageant? Final call on this bid. Well, which one? The one down there? Up here. Final call. Oh, my associate, Mr. Iraq. Sold. He's a loyal soldier. But Moving he is young. To the next item on your what do you see when you look down there? Well, Bidding has opened. Someone flexes his an opening bid. Mr. Iraq. Bid was raised. Sees it as an auction. He sees Open to raise. rewards. Experience has taught me not to be manipulated. Final call. Not to back Sold. down. Moving on to the next take item the on your tablets. Bidding has opened. 
We have an opening bid. Life has taught me a great many things to Another get me where I am. And any luck had nothing bids, to do with any of it. Bids are still open. Final call on this bid. Mr. Crispin. Final call. We don't trust you. I know we're leaving. Sold. Come here. Moving Closer. on to the next item on your tablet. A tattoo. It's a tracking device beneath the skin. It's also very efficient for business. Bidding has we can opened. scramble its signal. We have an opening bid. That's it? Yeah. Another bid received. Next item to be offered. I overheard them talking about Crispin. The they know something is wrong. You need to get out of here now. Through the basement. The Come with me. No. I won't leave my friends. Okay. We have an opening we'll send help. That bid was raised. Another thank Wake out here, close. Uh, we have an opening here. Please don't like domestic much. I better restock my weapons. Everyone's out to kill me now.
Emergency. There's a big shootout going on at the Barrows and Brandon docks. All units, we have a report of shots fired at the Barrows and Brandon docks. Please respond. Good. Cops will find those girls and get them someplace safe. As for those bitters, and he slipped past the bus, I'll end up on my plate eventually. Expose them for what they've done here. And shut down this ring. Mr. Pierce? Jax has wandered off. I'm very worried. I was going to call the police, but I wanted to call you first. No, no, that's good. He does this sometimes. He's stressed. He lives up to ride the trains. Don't worry. I know how to find him. Please call me once you know anything. We really should involve the police if you can't find him. It's going to be fine. Really. I was worried Jax would do this. He's not a kid that sits still. He's got a lot of his uncle in him. I've been searching for his mother. Where would he go? Jackson doing in here. It's 
that racing van. Damn it, he thinks his mother's here. This place is mob owned. After the auction mess, these guys will be on high security. someplace safe. Come on, Jax. Come on. There's so much I wish I could explain to you. Sorry about all this, Jax. I know it's not easy. Look, Jax. When I have to deal with these bad guys. I need you someplace safe. That's what makes me strong. I'm like the healer. Yeah, you're just like that. Except that's just a game. I'm warning you, if I don't hear from his mother, soon I will call the police.
appreciate what you did for me at the bricks, but Iraq couldn't believe it. But he did believe it, right? Yeah, yeah, he did. I mean, he's all proud and shit. Look, I, I can't risk pissing him off again, man. You understand? There's a bar near Rossi Fremont. I'm leaving something in the trash. It's a wire. Go get it. Listen, uh, you spooked him at the auction. Now nobody gets into the upper floors without his permission, including me. We'll be discreet. Come on, man. Ah, fuck. This gun will crawl under a rock. So then, at that point, hey, the comes to the door, and then I'm talking to you. I'm freaking out, and I go, all right, all right, I, yeah, that's me. Get me out of here. And I think I'm going to hold. But no, I'm not. I'm going to spend the night. So the cop goes out of the window himself. And so we walk by. And the thing I didn't mention is like, Bedbug better come through. Putting a lot of faith in this kid. I don't know if he's up for the job. He's the cleanest way in right now. Let's hope I don't kill him. Seriously, it's no one. Better than me if everybody thinks to be. So I bunch of gut man stuff. Shit, some of them are for sure. They're my decoys. I run them low level on the streets like a tag, bag, bang. But my crew, my real fam, I train them with the shit I brought back from the desert. Tactics, psychology, second. If anybody gets close to Rossi Fremont, they're gonna see what they wanna see drugs. Guns. You gotta get inside that building and stay very close to Bedbug's signal. If we lose communication, that could panic the kid. You need to keep him calm. <gasps> Something's up. You stupid man? I said walk. enough. Go. My finger's still on the play button if I think you're stalling me. If, if I get caught... He trusts you. You made sure of that. What's on Iraq's floor? You're going in today. No, no way. I can't. Listen. It's got some security door. You're covering. Just get your phone near it. You're going inside that room. I ain't no snitch. I don't talk to the cops. Good. I'm not a cop. I'm so scared, man. Just listen to what I say and move when I tell you. I'm gonna watch out for you. Go, go. This is crazy. Now, go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Relax. How old are you? At 19. I I'm 19, man. Jesus. You're still a kid. Grandma says I was always big for my age. Relax. How old are you? Nineteen. I'm nineteen, man. Jesus. You're still a kid. Grandma says I was always big for my age. Move ahead. Yeah, yeah. It ain't worth it, man.
Okay, move. Okay. Some other time. Move it. Crazy. Go, go. Yeah. Stay low. I said, I don't hear, man. The locks ain't no invitation. Just get close enough. On the Iraqi game, man. Hold up a sec. Need to look through your camera. Through there. Why are you doing this, man? This ain't your world. It's complicated. We got plenty of time. Iraq was involved in something that hurt my family. I want answers. That ain't so complicated. through there. Fucking cold, man. Yeah, it's to cool the servers. Jesus. That's some serious hardware. There. Get close. Shit. What? Just stay there. Wait, that's not enough. Go back. Hey, boy, what's this shit? Hang with it look like. What did it look like to you? Because it looked like a super-sized fucking betrayal to me. How the fuck you even get in no, here? No, hold on. No. I love you, man. You know that. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Who bought you? Quiz? No. Don't you wait, man. Don't you lie to me. No. Don't you fucking lie to my face. This is how you repay me for taking you in. Come on, cuz. I'm with family. You know it wasn't me. He, he, he made me do it. Much data. I hope there's enough. I see your bitch ass. Oh,
Thank you. What is he doing? Tell me you got something. It was only a partial download, but I definitely got something. It looks like his computer is full of blackmail on everybody. Just listen to these full of names. Police Chief Sex State, Bloom CEO Bribe, CTOS Breaches. Rack's sitting on the most dangerous weapon in the city. When did the cops stay away? He's probably had a chat with the police chief. Can you see what's inside the folders? Not yet. I'm trying. Is there a folder for the Merlot? Merlot. Yes, there is. Good. I'll be there soon. Hey. Hey, is this thing still working? Bedbug, you're alive. You need to get out of there. I am out. I, I, I just thought maybe I could help you get your answers. You know, uh, about your family? Uh, that video we saw on the screen. Iraq asked me about it. Uh, asked me what I knew about uh, Rose Washington. Rose Washington? I, I don't know who she is, but that's the girl in the video. Iraq says she's dead. Okay, thanks. That might help. Yeah. Yeah. You and me? We done? We're done. You did good, bed bug. He made a lot of noise at Rossi Fremont. Please give me good news. Iraq's got dirt on a lot of people. His computer's full of it. Everybody from politicians to... CTOS execs. The Merlot is in there, too. I knew it. I told you it was there. It's encrypted. I don't have access to it, but that video we found at the Merlot? The woman's name is Rose Washington. Rose Washington? I know that name. Wasn't she with CTOS? Aiden, you've hit pay dirt. I followed your IP. Now give me my sister. But we're just starting. That video is important to someone. Important enough to attack me, to attack your niece. Careful, Damien. Come on, I know you want to follow this to the end as much as I do. That wasn't our deal. Oh, but it was. You said it's encrypted. Then your job's not done. No, you're not gonna do this. I can do whatever I want. Hey, it's me. Nikki, how you doing? I'm tired. They're taking care of me, I guess. Just come get me, please. Okay. There's other people with you. All right, that's fine. Just be ready for anything. I'm coming to get you. I need to see Jax. How's he doing? He's... He's a brave boy. Takes after his mother. But he's stubborn like his bullheaded uncle. <laughs> yeah, I guess he is. Doesn't take no for an answer. Time's up. Ta-ta. I should have expected this from Damien. It's working an angle. I want something more. All right. One thing at a time. I'm gonna need the rest of Iraq's blackmail. Then I got leverage. And then I can deal with Damien. Everything all right? Uh, I didn't get much. The upload was cut off. Shit. I knew it. Okay. I have to find a way in myself. Are you crazy? Even if you did get inside there, we can't read it. It's encrypted. Well, what am I supposed to do? Damien has Nikki. Just tell him he can keep her? Of course not. Of course. I'm not saying that. But he's playing you. Yeah. I'm not gonna give him this before I know what it is. Damien cannot be trusted. I know that. All right, well, let's just... Let's just deal with one problem at a time. All right? If I can get this information, can you decrypt it? No. It's way beyond my skill. Then who, then? Hey, what about that, uh... That crazy guy? Uh, Tobias. He used to work here. Okay, that's where we start, then. Okay, but we need to be discreet. I know how to be discreet. Sorry. 
Okay. Okay. Wow. Wow. Raymond Kenny. It has to be him. He was a software engineer hired for the CTO startup. He created the encryption. The creator always has a backdoor. Wait, he can decrypt it. Kenny is crazy good. I bet he built this room. He's a genius. No, no. I mean, a legend. I'm guessing legends aren't easy to find. He's way off the grid. No one's heard of him in over a year. He's lurking somewhere. Okay. Everyone has history online. We start there. We get Kenny's last known point and work backwards. He's been gone over a year. This could take a while. There. He's covered his tracks very well, but he's bounced to one location a few times. So we trace it back and we find his location? In theory, yes. You'll need to reach that point and connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. And we'll have Kenny. To find him. The place you're going is the very end point of Raymond's last signal. Hackers hide their locations by routing their packets through buttons. Yeah, it's a good trick. I've tried it myself. He's probably bounced his signal all across the globe. We'll have a problem if that signal ends in China or some faraway country. No, he's here. I don't care if he's gone off the grid. If this is Kenny's ex bloom, something tells me he wants to stay close to the action. Maybe. But if he really was in Chicago, why has he been so quiet? He's not a kind of guy to just sit back and watch. You said he killed those people. Must be a pretty price on his head. Good reason to stay underground. Aiden, we might have a problem. I'm picking up a lot of chatter about Rem and Kenny. That's strange timing. You said this guy's been dark for a year. I think we might have alerted someone when I found Raymond's signal. So we'll have company else. waiting for us. A tech guy. All right. Yes. I think they want something from the computers. This is a lame contract. We better not get sued on payment. I'm still getting my rate. This place yeah, is a out. dump. Looks like no one's been here in months. Look out. Jesus, how long are we gonna wait? Someone's on to us, Clara. Let's make this quick. What am I looking for? Connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. Wow. Old school shit. No wonder good cops can't shut the club down.
Money? That's the best you could come up with, Ray? I better wipe the hard drive. I don't want anyone else tracking Kenny. Shit, he's taking off. Guy's got a lead on Kenny. Can't risk him running. Aiden. Someone's coming They can't find Kenny. You can't let them. I know, I'm on it. I'll shut them down. Hurry. Got what I need. We're ready. You're actually going after Ray Kenny. I can't believe we found him. Haven't found him yet, but we're close. He might not even help, you know? If he decrypts those files, he's exposing himself. This guy was a whistleblower. You said those files had blackmail on Bloom. There was blackmail on everyone. I think an ex-Bloom radical would find that hard to resist. When you find Ray Kenny, what do you have to offer him? We've seen what happens when we dig. He helps us decrypt those files. He's exposed. I'll find something. There's a reason he's hiding. Here. He turned against Bloom. Exposed their abuse. I can work with that. You're going to threaten him? No. The whistleblower wants justice. He may be looking for a cause. Hello, partner. I was just chatting with Nikki here. Saucy girl. You touch a hair, and I'll snap your neck. No surprise your siblings. She's a hothead like you. Why are you calling? She's wondering if you're coming to collect her. I said I'd check. I found someone who can decrypt the data. I'm all ears. His name's Raymond Kenny, an old CTOS developer. He's in Pawnee. I'm heading there now. Well, that is news. But I'm gonna use my veto here. What veto? He created the encryption. Raymond Kenny is also a whistleblower. He's gonna unlock all those juicy files and put them on the goddamn news. You know what secrets are when they hit the news? Worthless. I'm warning you. Find another way. There is no other way. You want this done, you need to get off my back and let me do it. Damien sounded worried. He's after the blackmail in those files. What's his game? What's he planning to do? All right, I can't let him distract me. 
Kenny's the answer. He'll help me decrypt everything. And I'll get Nikki safe. Got it. Honey, soda pop and apple pie. Yeah, but this small town charm is bullshit. Most of it's refugees from the city. Still hiding from something. I used to bring Jax and Lena here once in a while to fish. We never caught a single one. They never seem to care. And some of my best memories are from here. And my worst. Ray's last known signal came from that marina. It's too easy to expect he's there. When does it start?
Damn. That was sloppy, Pierce. Stay sharp. All right. Someone around here received the reset code. <gasps> Kenny bounced through a CTOS center. Well, looks like he's still in the game. That would explain why he chose Pawnee. He's sticking it to Bloom in their own backyard. This looks like an abandoned CTOS station. The power's still up. He must have piggybacked off this.
So Jed is the owner of Jedediah's Bar, Pawnee's number one watering hole. <laughs> Maybe the only one. I hope I catch the man sober. I was hoping you could help me. Looking for Ray Kenny? Never heard of him. Hope is a sad thing. What are you drinking? Pay the man. $100. Cash. Damage deposit. Yeah. I'm not really a cash kind of guy. This is going on your tab. So... What do you know about Raymond Kenny? You aren't very social, are you? Don't want no trouble, T-Bone. Never mind him. He's all kinds of cranky. No appreciation for artists. Artists my arse. Moody drunk, more like. Drink. Never mind the bartender. He's an all right Joe. Deep down. Really deep down. Don't worry about the flies. That there is protein. Walks it in like you own the joint? Since you're here, we'll have the good stuff. You haven't impressed me so far. I love to go swimming with bull-legged women. What did you say that name was again? Yeah, yeah. <coughs> 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 
You owe the man a hundred dollars. Now that the introductions are out of the way. Listen to me, pal. I'm warning you. You being here puts me on the goddamn map. I have some information. Well, ain't you special? The problem is... I can't decrypt it, so I came to the source. Shit. Then you have put me on the goddamn map. We've been careful. We? <laughs> Better give me a reason. Because that isn't making us the best of friends. Someone ordered a hit on me. Cost my niece her life. But whatever's in those files will lead me to them. I'm gonna find him with it without you. With you'd be a hell of a lot easier. Let's play make a deal. You think I'm in this dust bowl because of the, uh, ambiance? Ever since them bastards terminated me, I've been trying to find a way back in. All I need is someone to drop some spyware inside their network. If it were that easy, you would have done it a long time ago. Hey, if it was fucking hard, I would have done it a long time ago. It's impossible for me to even get at the perimeter without setting their damn alarms off. The place has my biometric profile. I got fillings in my head that sing to their security team direct. I can help you with that. But afterwards, you're gonna come with me to Chicago. Where am I now? <laughs> Follow me. Nice place. You got a real eye for art? That there is a booby trap. And if you can't recognize one, then you ain't paranoid enough, friend. I have quite a few. And well, if you found me, then it's only a matter of time before others will too. So let's get started. Listen, I'm running on a limited time here. The faster we can get this out of the way. I don't think you understand your own conundrum, my friend. Chicago is running on software designed to find people. Now, I know how the CTOS thinks, because I'm her deadbeat daddy. And she's still carrying my picture in her back pocket. Now, unless you can clear my biometrics from the system, I am useless to you in Chicago. As far as my art, as you call it, if you fuck things up for me, I need to be ready for the fallout. Huh? Here, let me show you. Ready? Heads up! Well, hello! You feel that ground shake? Whoa! That set my spine straight. Give it a go! Yeah! Ain't that something? Hey, if you blow your arm off... I'll sculpt you a new one. Your confidence is encouraging. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I here to boost your morale? Go, team, go. I think you misunderstand our relationship. I see an opportunity. You can help me, I can help you. I think you're missing the point. I found a sad drunk at Jed's bar toasting his glory days in private. 
I'm not an opportunity. I'm your second chance. <laughs> well, hell. I think I like you. But it don't make us friends. First thing I'm gonna need is some of Bloom's hardware. I've been out of the loop for a while. I need to figure out how their scanners work. You want me to break into Bloom? Not yet. Somebody else already stole the hardware. Inside job. Well, that stuff's big on the black market. I've scouted these guys. Let's just say they're big fans of the Second Amendment. Take one of my rifles. You're gonna need it. Swing by the gas station for me, will you? I got the Pawnee militia holding what's mine. So I need you to go in and grab me my truck. I'm out in the middle of Podunk nowhere making pals with a disgruntled cyber terrorist. Still, I need him on my side. Not just for the data. I use him against Damien if it comes down to that. I'll live up to my end of the deal. That's a lot of guys. You sure don't make it easy, t -Bone. I need a closer look. Oh. Pick him off. No radio contact. Where are those guys? Let's send some men out and see what the hell's going on. Hit him! Could this truck be any slower? Are you kidding? You actually oh, got it? Your gun. <laughs> yeah, I got it. If you want the truck, you're gonna have to do better than that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Bring him up next to one of the We'll have a little round of art appreciation. to dip his hands in their blood and make a little art show. He's a fucking animal. Better hope he never runs into me. The bunk has been making noise. What kind of noise? It's online. Some people have noticed. Script kiddies, mostly. Nothing to worry about. I'll make sure they stay out. We've been probed a few times. Probed? <laughs> there is only one that worries me. His name is Default, and he's very good. I'll watch him. Let me know if he becomes a problem. All right, I left the truck for you. God damn, this plan might actually work. All right, now, you're gonna need security clearance to get inside Blue Mage Q. Have you ever chased a helicopter? 
And no, that is not oh. a philosophical question. I've been chased by a few. What does that have to do with anything? Call it a hunch. We'll talk soon. Okay, I'm in position. Now, what about these helicopters? Wait for it. Go! Don't lose it! helps us because? Because it's a routine. Bloom HQ changes security protocol every day. Blackbird makes a trip over Pawnee with the new assignment. So basically, the chopper's gonna lead us to the security chief. And Bingo was her name, oh. Make any sense? Wait a minute, it makes perfect sense. A lot of the Pawnee militia run security for Bloom, and a lot of them live in that pit of paranoia. And one of them's the security chief. With full access. I can hardly wait. You remember that bunch protecting the truck? Same gang. The Pawnee militia is made up of preppers. Survivalists, anti-government types, my kind of people, which means they won't fuck around.
access to Bloom HQ now. I'm sorry I doubted you. Why would you doubt me? I'm a realist. Listen, I'm coding a dirty little virus to erase me from their system. Damn, I'm good. And then I waltz into Bloom with my access and your code. What's security like? Oh, good point. You might call it... thick? Yeah, well, let's thin their numbers then. You tracking any of their truck deliveries? Of course I am. Send me the routes and let me make some noise. The Pawnee Militia is made of security contractors. That means when they fuck up, they lose business. If I create some fuck-ups, they'll send more men. That means less of them at Bloom. Let's see this route T-Bone sent. And these guys are on a pretty direct path. Lots of opportunities for me. doesn't know what hit him. We've got a window. Damn. I wish I'd known you years ago. The things we could have done. Don't worry. We'll do lots in Chicago. You got your virus ready for me? More or less. More or less? More. It'll work. I think. What does that mean? I'm walking into the lion's den. Don't be dramatic. You reach their servers, this thing will work. And you and the legend Claire has been raving about. The what? Uh -oh. Never mind. T-Bone's coming with me to Chicago. Had to breach the building. Bloom's head office. Security specialist. Yeah, it's not gonna be easy. And I'm a giant blip on their radar. But once I'm done here, I got Raymond Kenny in my back pocket. Perimeter 
alert is monitored. They spot you, and they'll put the servers in lockdown. That'll end things real fast. So don't get spotted. No problem. Closer look.
Once you've dropped the spyware in, it'll launch a virus. That'll scan the system for my data and wipe it all. And they won't detect the spyware? Nope. I'll be able to watch them, but <laughs> no more watching me. Miss Gardner, there's a Damien Brinks here to see you. Damien Brinks? What's this about? He said it's about Raymond Kenny. I see. I've done it. Send him over. The name's wiped and the spyware's in. <sighs> yeah, I'm getting pings already. Good job. Now get out of there. In a sec. A name came up on the server. Someone I know is in the building. I'm gonna check it out. Don't screw around, Aiden. These guys ain't country yokels. I'll be there soon. Damn it. Damien's gonna fuck this all up. Why can't he see that? We need Ray Kenny. Gotta get him out of this. Stop me, and he's actually trying. He won't win this one. You got trouble headed your way. Loom knows where you are. I think you're confused, amigo, because I clearly remember sending you in there to erase me from Loom's radar. Well, it worked, except the militia's coming for you. Some days I should just listen to the voice in my head that says, Stay in bed. Some days, yeah. Jesus stepped after Christ. You're all right. Let's hurry the fuck up. Thank you, Pierce. 
It's me. Are they dead yet? I'm working on it. Can you take them out? I, I got a snag here. I, I need some time. I got some mean looking kids on my lawn here. Better gun it. So we're clear. I'm holding you responsible. That's fair. We need to get moving. Focus. Shit! Focus. I'm gonna have to blow the whole place up! I need to arm some more traps. Oh, shit. Oh, well. Follow me! Aiden, move your ass! Bomb's in place, but it ain't ready. The detonator needs a few seconds to reach its charge. I need to make sure they can't deactivate them. You got earphones? What? Exactly. One place rigged, one more to go. Detonators only need a few seconds. If we want fireworks, we gotta hold one second. Can't let them move in yet, hold them off. Just about there. Get them guys! 
I'm allergic to dying, Aiden! Keep him off of me! Told you it was all gonna go to shit, man. <laughs> Woohoo! Here, you wanna do the owners? Wait a second, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. For my portfolio. Go ahead. <laughs> Sorry about the attack. Don't be. I try not to get attached to things anymore. Because I'm used to losing them. Yeah, I need to learn that. I don't let go very well. Oh, I'm at Mount St. Helens right now, believe me. But that don't mean I'm not grateful. Despite that setback, I'm a free man now. I owe you. Now it's back to Shark Town. So, you got a place for me to stay, man? Uh, we're... Squatting in your old CTOS station. Not the bunker. <laughs> well, that'll do it. I can't wait to pick apart these files of yours to see what's caused all this hullabaloo. That data can't leak, T-Bone. I'm trading it for my sister. You got nothing to worry about. You did me a solid. Now it's my turn. that that's the weight of trillions of bots of information at your fingertips well you are gonna have to lay low here for a while uh -huh. what's this all about I don't know she's somehow connected to an old job someone doesn't want me to find out why Well, you want to tell me what happened? Corporate espionage, crooked cops, big explosions, honey. And you are? This is Clara. Clara, this is T-Bone, otherwise known as the legendary Raymond Kenny. Really? We can't all be pretty in this game, honey. No, I... I, I mean, I... Wow. I'm a fan. Oh. Enchanté. All right. What happened? Well, Damien was there. What? How did he know? I don't know. He's working on a deal of his own. Something with Bloom. You never told me that. Hang on. No, hang on nothing. You better tell me what you're messed up in, all of it, or I ain't decrypting jack shit. Now, Damien and Bloom. You don't need to worry about that. I'll decide what I need to worry about, Aiden. You listen to me. I want a name in that server. Now, our deal is I bring you the information, you decrypt it. Hmm. Well, then you got a big problem. Hey, we need your expertise. 
server is using your encryption. We need Raymond Kenny. Are you sure you're going to be able to get this data without getting caught? No. Yeah. Finally, some honesty. Well, you better get going then, man. Claire here can fill me in on a few things. Thanks. Fits. Clara's on monitors, T-Bone's helping me breach Iraq's fortress, and Jordy... Well, Jordy does what Jordy does. It's time to see what Iraq's been protecting. Where the hell you been? Pawnee. Oh, my condolences. I'm going inside Rossi Fremont. I need your help. You don't pay me enough. I'm not entering that death trap. You don't have to. I need you behind the scope. Again? Ah, huh. it's more reasonable. Hey, you won't guess where I am. You're absolutely right. I'm watering your plant. Maurice, put him on. <laughs> what? What? Who is this? <laughs> if you don't talk, you don't leave. Oh, no. Come on, please. I got no name! You don't understand, I'm trapped! I can't stop! I can't stop seeing that little girl! She's just... She's just... She's just looking at me! Shut up. I said, shut up. All right, Weepy, back to your corner. Jesus, Pierce, what did you say to him? You'll meet me there. Rossi Fremont. Of course. I'll be in place. No bed bug this time. I'm going in alone. Seen the layout? I know the room. Iraq's in there somewhere, and it won't take him long to realize I'm coming. He knows what I'm after now. This time I leave with everything. Get this door open? We're working on it. T-Bone's got an idea. Yeah. They're running my encryption on the security doors. It's kind of hard to finagle remotely, but your Wonder Girl here? She just had a damn good idea. If you can cut power to that door, it's gonna default to the base code for about half a second. And you know the base code? Yep. I wrote the damn algorithm. Let's give it a whirl. Oh, 
receiving everything now. I see it. It's all coming in. T-Bone's going to start decrypting it as soon as we have it all. That's a pretty big download. All of this is Iraq's leverage, his blackmail. He's been collecting this for a long time. There. That's everything. Hurry back, Aiden. T-Bone's decrypting it now. I'm on my way. No, no, wait. Pierce, right? It's all you, Pierce? The auction? Correct. You the shit raining down on me? Because I got a lot of shit raining down on me. <laughs> Stop right there. I'm not about to let you get away with this. You've been fucking me up, snooping in my shit, right? Interfering with my plans. Iraq, 
They're all dead. It was you. You were the other hacker in the Merlot. If that there is my currency, my masterpiece, and you're trying to take that from me. You took something far more valuable from me. I took from you. Motherfucker, I don't even know you. King in a tiny castle. See, you're wrong! And you're Lucky Quinn's lapdog. <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you! Yeah! Yeah, I seen your type before, man. Self-righteous motherfuckers. I tried to counter people off the battlefield. Take every file you have. All of your hard work, gone. The Merlot's a slick hotel. Bunch of rich white motherfuckers just waiting to pay them. So you take it from me, eventually someone's gonna take it from you too. The secrets get passed around. And all sorts of people are going to die for the secrets. That's the curse of power. Not us making a deal. You pick the fight, Pierce. Let's play it out. I got my eyes on you, motherfucker. I'm gonna end you. was protecting a tinderbox of blackmail. But he was after something bigger. He wanted the video from the Merlot job. He never did find it. Well, the viceroys are gonna regroup, and the new leader will step up. And Bedbug? He's got a chance to get out now. I hope he takes that chance. Shoulder. Bill, we always been strong as a team. You know that. 
that, it's not weakness to admit it. Let's face it. Without me, you wouldn't have the data. And you have it, don't you? Yeah, all of it. I want Nikki. My god, I was right to bring you in. You see? We did it. Now bring it to me. Directly. No one else. Let's do this. Hey, see this? Nice work. <laughs> There's so much, Aiden. Hmm? Yeah, we just gotta sift through this stuff and find a name. Yeah, well, you're in luck. Because this mess has a shitload of names. Every one of them tied to some crooked deal. Dirty cops, the club, greedy moguls, even your stand-up do-gooders. Iraq was planning to blackmail the whole city. Mm -hmm. What's this? Is this officer? Oh, hell! Somebody's trying to hack in! We'll lose everything! Shut him out! Now! What do we do? Follow that signal back. If we can find the source, we can kill his access. Hurry! That's him. Default. Son of a bitch. Who is it, Clara? He seems to know you. She's the person. I don't know. May I play? It wasn't too difficult to find them. Two men. One's a hacker, the other a fixer. As far as I could tell. Never heard of them before. I can't explain. I, I, I wanted to tell you. Nice work. Names, please. Are you planning to hurt them? When has that ever bothered you? I trust the amount is satisfactory. Damien Brinks and Aiden Perry. Aiden? Someone's knocking. Clara. Aiden, he's trying to delete our ship. We're gonna have to shut him out fast. Aiden, come on! Gird your loins, I'm killing the power! Aiden. Who was it? Warden. If I knew, I'd tell you. I swear I would. I'm so sorry. Get away from me. <laughs> Trace it. Yeah. I'm on it. Son of a bitch. Come on, man. Come on! Ugh. Damn it! Where are you going? That smart ass just hit us with one hell of a virus. He copied everything we had and wiped it from our systems. He knew exactly how to shut us down. I gotta go reboot the backup teller. Without it, no default. No default, no data. I'll go. No, 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 no. I'll go. I don't mind getting my hands dirty, man. You know what, Aiden? You're gonna have to stall Damien just a little while longer. I can handle Damien. I'll call you when I'm done. 
Good luck, amigo. Rat boy just made it personal. He's playing this default. He's putting Mickey's life at risk. He picked the wrong time to piss me off. Right now, I had to stall Damien. second he sees me. Maybe I can make that work for me. He told Bloom he'd deliver what we found, including the blackmail Iraq has on them. Yeah, he's painted himself into a corner. You didn't bring my data, I didn't bring your sister. We're so predictable. made a deal with Bloom. Where did you hear that? You have a problem, Damien. See, that deal hinges on the hard drive. What are you gonna tell them if I give you nothing? You're forgetting something. Your sister lives or dies in a phone call. Hmm. Then kill her. You almost had me, Abe. You're not thinking it through, Damien. That deal has sealed your fate. If you kill Nikki, you get nothing from me. You think Bloom is gonna give you a pass? They're gonna send fixers to hunt you down. So right now, I'm the one who decides your fate. Get my sister on the phone. We really are partners, Aiden. Like it or not, We need each other. Aiden? You okay? Are you all right? I'm scared. Please tell me that Jackson is safe. <laughs> yeah, he's okay. Look, Nikki, I'm... I know. Just please don't let them... You know something, Aiden? I'm tired of you not taking me seriously. Next time I see you, if you don't have my data, she's dead. Shit, better not hang around. Jesus, that's the guy! He's the one they're talking about! The vigilante! Wait, that's the guy from the news! Do not approach the suspect. He is considered armed and dangerous. Uh, Damn it. 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 Oh, 
Location. Now, I'll take back what he stole. If he sells Iraq's blackmail on the open market, this has all been for nothing. Whether it disappears or it goes public, I'll have nothing left to offer Damien. Get the toys. We gotta get you out. Where is 
busy. Kids got fixers working for him. Whatever alarms we tripped, you sent these guys running. These fuckers came pretty fast. Just stay low. I'll get you clear. I found something in his computer. Besides that funky prototype shit. Now where the hell did he find that? Man, if I just had ten minutes more... What did you find? Huh? On his computer. Right. A, a weakness. I found a weakness in there. He's carrying the data with him. Like, on his person. It's a security measure, I guess, but... He ain't as secure as he'd like to think. That bastard. Back of units on site. No way you lost us that easily.
connection. Everybody in Chicago's heard of it. Yeah, well, what do you fucking do, man? Whatever it is, it seems to be default's local haunt. Is that all you got? Oh, and I found a six gig USB stick full of lesbian porn. You want that too? Keep it. Shit! Ah! Oh! Has a sister. But then some say he also has a brother. There's no evidence to back up most. The Ambrose. Nikki and I used to catch a movie here, not just some dance club. Default must know we tripped his alarm. Yeah, he's probably expecting me. profiler system. He's toying with me. Go ahead. Keep it up, kid. Thank you. 
in over his head. Okay, I've got him now. Just keep him in range and T-Bone will hack in. She's dead now, but something about that video was dangerous enough to attack me and my family. trying to steal it from someone. So who? the audio I sent. Have a listen. Brent Alston, the voice of the office, British Bolton. Vicky's call came from the same place as that little public address. Brent Alston. This is good. I'll run a search on his workplace.
I found Nikki. Finally. And Damien doesn't know. Okay, just move carefully. We'll have her guarded. I hope she's ready to move. Now watch yourself in there. It says here the joints hired fixers for private security. They tend to shoot first and ask questions never. Yeah, I'll hack in under the radar. They'll never know I was there. Nikki, it's me. Aiden! Oh, where are you? There's men everywhere. The, the guard here, he just... I don't know what happened. Listen, I know. I'm getting you out. I'm gonna stay on the phone. And I'm gonna walk you out. No! They'll find me. Nikki, there's a gun there. I want you to pick it up. Just in case. Oh, God. This is crazy. Aiden, I don't know guns. Ethan. I shot him. We gotta move. Listen to my voice. I think I killed him. Nikki, listen to me. We're gonna move now. I'm gonna guide you every step. The hell's going on? You're still breathing. Go, quickly. Listen to my voice. Right now, we're gonna get you out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Go that way. Be careful. I got nothing. I'll check over there. Move ahead. God. Okay. Okay, go. move. Quickly. Here I go. Just make a run for that car. Get in and drive. Don't look back. All right. You're in the clear. But we need to get you and Jax out of town. Jackson's okay? Oh, God. He said, he said you were dead. He said he'd kill me. Where's Jax? I need to see him now. He's safe with Yolanda. Going there now. I'll meet you. Get Jack, stay low, and no phones. Don't even let him use his tablet until this is over. Whatever it is, We're here. Aiden, you need help? Please let it go. Hear me? Let it go.
crash into him! Heading in! Ram his side! It's over for Nikki, and not for you. Not to spoil the plans, but company's on the way. Chicago police just got a big tip on the vigilante. This all a game to you, Damien? Oh, sure. It's just a game. I'm in it for the ducks. You've disappointed me, Aiden. We were partners. You blame me for what? Ambition? I blame you for your greed. <laughs> uh, I need to go. Your hypocrisy is stifling. Drive safe, partner. The cops are hungry to catch you. I'm coming to pick you guys up. Get your stuff together. I'm trying to pack light, only bring what you need. Okay, we'll be ready when you get there. I worked so hard to keep Nikki shielded from everything, and now... She's killed someone. Oh, damn, city's collapsing around us. I need to get her away, safe, before it's too late. Come on. Yolanda said she's gonna call the police on you. Get in the car, let's go. Tell me you were set up. Tell me! I found him. The man who hurt her. I know who it is. What? Nick, we're out of time. We need to go. Now! Come on! Everything that happened. Nikki, listen. If we're caught, you don't say anything. Right now, I'm getting you two out of the city. You'll disappear and stay invisible. 
I'll take care of Damien. No, you're not making any sense. We don't have anything to hide, do we? We've got a high-powered patrol car in pursuit of suspect. You're the vigilant? It's complicated. Since I've been gone, what did you do to get me out? I did what I had to. Aiden, watch out! It's fun. There used to be an ice cream shop near here. Everything I know is in Chicago, my home. And now we just start again? I thought things would be different. I hoped. Things will be different. I promise you. No more promises, Aiden. Where are we going? I'm getting you and Jax. Away from here. And then what? We can move out of state and stay with me. No, don't tell me. Don't tell anyone. It's over. For you guys. But not for you. It's okay, Jax. Didn't have to be this way, but what other options do we have? Are we okay? Remember when we were kids? And I would... follow you? And you'd try and get away from me, and... stupid me, I kept trying. I didn't like your cars, or... hockey. And your friends were gross. I followed you because I idolized you. Like Jackson does. And I kept hoping that you want me around, but... Eventually, I just hoped that you would look back. All I can say is I'm sorry. I'm not following you anymore. I know. <laughs> All right, sweetie. We're leaving now. Say goodbye to your uncle, Aiden. Are you coming with us? No. Your uncle's staying here. Bye, Jax. Metal 
shed light and who you're looking for. Are you ready for this? Probably not. Play it anyway. I want you to run an errand for me, Mr. Iraq. Right. Bit of name and address for this errand, Mr. Quinn. Blinks and Pierce. Make a strong warning. Get the family if you have to. Sir, yes, sir. What they do? Not your concern, Mr. Iraq. Do as you told. And I'll let you be in charge of the auction next year. He's one cold son of a bitch. Fucking Quinn. It was just supposed to be a fast job, a big payoff, no problem. Fucking my boss. It ain't my place to tell you what to do, but in case you're wondering, Quinn's got some charity thing going on. At his hotel, the Merlot. Nikki'll never come back. I've driven her from her home, from me. I know she's safe. We're both safe. Now, Quinn. Lucky Quinn. He's brought all of this on us. He's the ghost I've been chasing. Well, now it'll answer to me. The Milad Hotel. This is where it started. My whole world crushed because of this place. Because of Lucky Quinn. He ordered the attack on me. On my family. Now well, he's gonna tell me why. And then he's gonna die. It's me. Where are you? We should meet. I've always made my money finding information for people. The harder it was to find, the more money I made. You didn't know what they do. I'm going to fix things. There's nothing to fix. I'm sorry, Aiden. Clara, what's going on? What are you gonna do? at all. <laughs> Lucky and I go way back. Way back. What I know about Lucky. <laughs> Funny, you know. After knowing him for so long, I only recently just started calling him Lucky. Where, where was I? Many know, as well as I do, how big Lucky's heart is. Generous to our city. And now with his charity, stretching around the world, his generosity knows no bounds. I'd like to propose a toast. To, to Lucky Quinn. Mayor Rushmore, everyone. Thanks very much, Mayor. Enjoy your evening, everyone. Thank you for helping a great cause. My husband's contributed a large sum in the past to the cause. I'm sure we'll do it again this year. I have to give a win. Watch my wife. Make sure she doesn't drink any more champagne. Who's the man I saw Quinn with earlier? The tall man. Yeah. No, no, you're not listening to me. I want out. Hear me? I want out from this. Think I have time for more of your whining? Gang shootings? And that, that godforsaken auction fiasco? You've made both of us targets. You wanted to be mayor. Do your bloody job. Say what I told you to say. 
Your men took out Iraq. Our fine mayor. Baffling. Gang cry. Rose would be so proud. How dare you? Give me that damn video. You're out. When I say you're out. Gave your speech. Now please, leave my hotel. I have more important matters than you. You've ruined me. I'm not gonna stand for it anymore. Are you listening to me, Lucky? We've got I've an intrusion in the hotel security. So <laughs> Holy crap! That's not good. True. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> oh, what the hell? Hey. Oh. You fought with the wrong! <laughs> Don't let him fuck with you! You don't have a fucking... <laughs> oh. You don't take warnings very well. You're a smart man. You should know when you're beaten. <laughs> that hit you ordered. My niece died in that car. Six-year-old girl. Oh. Is this what all the fuss is about? <clears throat> you must forgive me. You know, so many people come to me with the little problems. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's hard to keep track sometimes. <laughs> you better think fast, Steve. On sight! Engaging target now. Off, no problem. <laughs>
young man, Mr. Pierce. Just walk away. Live your life. I assure you, this room is impenetrable. So many people trying to catch you, including myself. You've been more elusive than we anticipated. Do you expect applause when you go out there with a city of folks which knees and gratitude? Everything all right? on your escape right now I came here for you you think bulletproof glass is going to stop me watching an old man die bigger man than you've tried to destroy me I've ripped them apart one Expect me to bake? Lucky Quinn? On his knees. Beg all you want, that doesn't interest me. You don't even know why we attacked you. It was a mistake. We thought you wanted this. You were just sloppy. If you'd walked away, I would have forgotten you. What a lovely woman, Rose Washington. Wasn't for her death, where would I be? <laughs> Most women die without purpose. But she had enough sense to die in front of the camera. <laughs> See, and our mayor never tied you with his secrets. Stupid enough to fall in love. Mm -hmm. All of this. Lena's death. Because you didn't want to lose a puppet. Do you think you've won? You see, when I die, they'll build a statue. You and you? The city didn't oh stop God, the for your grieving family. But you don't matter. I, I know I have proof. Haven't you heard? I'm the vigilante. I clean up mess like you. Quinn's dead. This is the part where I'm supposed to say I feel empty, right? I'd be lying to myself. I finally feel awake. Like I can breathe again. And Lena? Nothing can change her death. But maybe I can still do something that'll make a difference. It was Quinn after all. I'm uploading a video to you now. A video? Of what? You'll see. Are you 
units, this is squad. Air support is approved and inbound.
Aiden. I can't decide where to begin. The first time I saw you, you were playing chess with Jackson in the park. Both of you feel very sad from the funeral. I could see how you made him feel safe. In our world, we hide in the dark, behind monitors. That's the only place we feel safe. It isn't enough to say that I didn't know. That lives would be lost or that it was only a job. I thought, if I could help you heal, help you find answers, maybe I could heal myself. But I can't. When this is all over, I hope we can at least talk. Or if not, at least I can't disappear. That's something I'm good at. What have I done? Permiso. I brought this on, Clara. And all of this oh. comes down to blackmail. Six-year-old girl dies because an old man wants to protect his secrets. Bloom. They can spin all they want to the press, but their hands are bloody. I'm done with secrets. Tell me you got everything you wanted because I'm fucking tired. It's Clara. She's... Forget her. You got enough to worry about. She's dead. Oh, no. Oh, God damn it. I'm on my way back. It's time to end all this. One of Chicago's most notorious personalities, Dermot Lucky Quinn, is dead. Quinn was believed to have mob ties with the Chicago South Club for many decades. But no criminal charges were ever brought against him. Felipe Quinn died after a charity event. go out, bad things tend to happen. Where several of Bloom's top executives are now being
shocking footage has surfaced implicating Mayor Rushmore in the murder of a woman, Rose Washington. The woman was a former CTOS employee reported missing over a year ago. Mayor Rushmore has refused to comment, but a statement released by City Hall claims the footage is a fake, made by the hacker group DedSec in order to discredit the mayor. get past the firewall. Evo might have an idea. He blocked us out. I need him disconnected fast. Well, shit. I got one idea, but last time I did it, people died. If we don't do it, people will die. What do you got? The whole network's tied to a satellite. Runs as kind of a safety valve to CTOS. I got a homemade virus. A real mean motherfucker. You gotta install it from three separate points. What does it do? It'll shut down your man. That's for damn sure. This could get ugly. You don't know the half of it, amigo. Call me when they're installed. We'll get it done right. Come on! Aiden, impress me! What will you do now? 
Throw me off my game? Come on! You can do better. Damien's screwing with the navigation. He's trying to slow me down. This is the only location I can tell.
Upload your little virus, it sniffs around and finds me. Then you come beat up the cripple. That about right. I'd have guessed your hacker chick invented this little gambit, but then she's dead. Isn't she? Well, have at it, Aiden. Give me your best and I'll give you mine. And you can brag all about it in the afterlife.
done. Your viruses are in. All right. We're in and now. Do you head back to that weak point? Right where we started. That'll open up for you like a lady's... Uh, never mind. You'll have a clear line to the satellite, and that's what's important. Okay, clear line to the satellite. You say that's the safety valve? And a little more. Once you're inside, you pull the trigger. Lights out, Aiden. And if we're lucky, and I'm as clever as my CV says, you'll get a lock on Damien's location. That's all I want. Enjoy the show. Give us 30 seconds. For what? 30 seconds inside ZTOS, we drop in our code. Then, when the system reboots, DevSec will control the machine from inside. We will correct what boom is broken. 30 seconds is all we need. 30 seconds, no one knows? Our little secret? We will be the watchdogs. No. I'm tired of all the noise. We will not forget this. Damn stubborn. Quinn's dead. You got your sister back, and Clara? She stabbed you in the back. She helped kill your precious Lena. You know it's true. What about you? Some might blame you for Lena's death. I wonder who would think that, huh? But why stop there? Perhaps we should blame you. As I recall, the Murloc job was your plan. I blame myself every day for the plan, for meeting you, for not stopping you when I had the chance. 
I don't make that mistake anymore. I see a problem, I step in. Oh, yes. The vigilante. I've read your headlines. You're the only problem I see now. And I'm coming for you. Remember when you and I first decided to pool our talents? The schemes we were planning? <laughs> we had so much drive, but never like this. Look outside. We've taken down a goddamn city! Surprise, surprise. You got a speech, Damien? Anything you want to say? I know who I am now. That's it? That's all you got? Hey, fuck you! Look at you! You plowed over people to get to a mob boss. You think you're absolved because your cause is what? Noble? You played me. That's what this is about. I played you! Clara is as much your fault. So is your niece. That's why you sent your family away, right? They know what you are. You play a beautiful game, but sometimes you still lose. Blah, blah, blah. Jesus, you guys talk a lot. What are you doing here? Sorry, pal. New contract. Kick it over. What? Come on, kick it over. Oh, you're hilarious. You know, you guys take things far too personally. That's your problem. That's why this went wrong. There's lessons to be learned here, fellas. Up, 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 phone two. Give it to me. Come on, hand it over. I thought I could fix a little girl's death, but instead it led to all of this. 
Those lies, corrupted kings, a broken city. And me, changed man. I don't look back anymore. I don't regret. I look forward. Everything is connected. And I'll use that to expose, to protect. Once again, Mayor Rushmore is dead. Police are not revealing any information. The leaked documents found extensive corruption and deep ties between the mayor and the Chicago South Club leader, Lucky Quinn. Did the mayor kill himself over this exposure, or was he executed? Bloom Director of Public Relations, Charlotte Gardner, has issued a statement regarding the recent CTOS troubles. We knew all along that our CTOS network would be a target for hackers of all strengths and skills. It's been an excellent proving ground to demonstrate how robust our system really is. We're so pleased with the results. Our firewall security withheld the worst of the attacks, and in some cases, trip switches closed the systems off before any access could be gained. Your personal information remains secure. Our CTOS network is restored to full operations. In a world where we want to spend more time with loved ones, be active in our communities, have safer, healthier homes and cities, Bloom Industries listen to you and your needs. We are embarking on a global journey. We want the world to be a community. CTOS 2.0, focusing on you, putting you on the global stage. CTOS 2.0, making smart cities even smarter. Up next, an interview with a woman who claims to know the vigilante, Aiden Pierce. Renowned child psychologist Yolanda Mendez is with us. Dr. Mendez, your story is extraordinary. You actually know Aiden Pierce, the man we know as the vigilante. Tell us how that came about. I met Mr. Pierce through the family, his sister. This was a surprise to us. We couldn't find any information about him at all. It's great that you've come forward. You were treating her son for trauma? Yes, well, naturally, I can't discuss any of that. Not even their names. No, 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 no. <laughs> we wouldn't ask you to. But that's how you met Aiden Pierce. What's he like? It's impossible to say for certain what he's really like. He masks his personality, and he's very good at it. Is he? He isn't like someone playing poker. This is a very smart man who is looking to gain the upper hand in every situation. And you're writing a book. Yes, I am. It's a book about the whole experience, a study on Mr. Pierce. I really wanted to explore this complex man's mind. I'm sure it'll be a fascinating read. Dr. Mendez, thank you. Sick has had enough. Our warnings have fallen on deaf ears. Our reputation has been attacked by weaklings such as default. Heed our final warning. There will be a reckoning. We are vigilant against the Watchers. We are capable. We are unstoppable. We are at war. And as the search continues for the vigilante known as the Fox, Top brass in the Chicago Police Department are urging city and state governments to allow stricter penalties against those who commit crimes in the name of law and order. Anyone who follows in the Fox's footsteps will, quote, be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. With Chicago still reeling from the shocking revelations of Rose Washington's murder and Mayor Rushmore's subsequent death, there has been little appetite for politics or elections. One name that's been floated about is Bloom's VP of Communications, Charlotte Gardner. Her supporters insist Ms. Gardner will restore integrity and trust to a city that sorely needs it. 
city officials are picking up the pieces from the shocking chaos brought on by a massive CTOS malfunction. The city experienced major power outages, bridge disruptions, and thousands of dollars in damages. While CTOS is back online, many are raising questions about the safety features needed to run a complex system in a major city.